Hmm. Let's start the pre-show. <laughs> Your point of view is just boring. So, the, the pre-show. The pre-show hey. is just about how <laughs> defeated we feel. Wait, wait, copyright, what is that? About me, goodbye. About Welcome me. to the third pre-show. Um. Yeah, <laughs> we've been trying to stream Creature Talk, which... Has been, been having an effort some for nothing. serious issues with. Uh, Last two I don't hours. know if it's the computer, XSplit, OBS, or all three, but issues <laughs> just randomly crashing. Yeah, um, it's not fun. So, so we hate, we're just gonna do. As you can see, we have video. So it's if you're watching the YouTube, if you're listening on to iTunes, there isn't video. But go to YouTube. <laughs> go to YouTube. Yeah, go to YouTube if you want to see us. We're gonna try this format out. See if we want to do it regularly. Because um, we were going to try to stream regularly, but that does not seem like it's going to be that good of a thing. Alternative, no. So, but, uh, yeah, so we're going to do video pretty much from now on, hopefully. And we'll work that out. So, yep. I'm not on camera, though, because our other camera is almost dead from trying to stream off of it and everything, and we need to get a charger for that. So I'm not on camera, but I'm here. Hey, hi. <laughs> He's trying to crawl into this. There side. he is. So I'm that here. was me. He is there. Uh, Probably one of the last times you'll see me on there. So did you think about me? So I don't think we want to do another pre-show. So let's just start the show. I, I like that idea. Shame's just sneezed. I really like yep. pre-shows. Hashtag Google Hangouts. Hashtag No pre-shows. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome, everyone, to Creech Talk for August 3rd, 2013. How many times have you done Woo! that today? That would be my third time doing that, Dan. My third, third time, time. For the intro. Welcome to Creech Talk. Um, we're sitting here with Seamus. Yep. Alex. Hey. James. This is myself. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and Dan's over off camera, Hi. as he said in the pre show. Yeah. Um, as you can tell, uh, we're massively defeated right now. But it's we're going to try and pull it together and create a creature talk that is it is Memorable. enjoyable uh, to, for your listening and viewing pleasure. Exactly. So meanwhile, topic number one <laughs> that we started on. We, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Comic-Con. 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 All right, this is so easy, I guess we started from the point of view earlier in our first attempt at talking about we this. We started from the bottom. We started from the bottom, <coughs> booking, now, booking the flights the and or here. hotels. Anyway, so this is the part where I intercepted, and I was like, hey, yes. no, that, no, this is how it went down. Are we trying to exactly recreate we, what yeah. happened? Yeah. Are we scripting? <laughs> <laughs> this is a scripted if we're doing that, creature then, talk. <laughs> this isn't a scripted creature this talk. A if we're doing that, then I, I started off wrong, because I was like, we flew out, and we got to the hotel. And then you were like, oh. All right, we'll do that. Okay, so. And then okay. I came the, down and sat down. So we flew and then out. And me and Seamus sat here and we were like, whoa. We're like, damn. We flew wow. out and Dude, we got to we San Diego. You, you said, I think you looked at Dan. And I was Can you like, shut the fuck up? I'm trying to interrupt so sh- him. This okay. isn't by the script. Okay. Shut up. I didn't. Okay. I'm, just, I'm trying to get my stage From the, From right. the top? From the yes. top? Okay. So, okay. So, yeah, we went to San Diego Comic Con. We, we flew out and we got to the airport in San Diego. Oh, Dan, that's it, not the well, way it went. Oh, uh, well, how? That wasn't very uh, I'm natural. sorry. Well, before that. Okay. Can we do another version of that? Can, can we, we do, do the pre show again? <laughs> <laughs> can we do another version where James doesn't look like he hates himself as he says that? That's not going to happen during this creature talk. <laughs> <laughs> not on this creature talk. Not Alex, on this sorry. one. We're live. So anyway, as I was saying, I had talked to Dan previously about the hotel situation (laughs) prior to going and prior to me thinking, I believed that you two, it was between Jordan and Dan, the booking of the hotel, only them two, so the blame can only lie in between them two. Yeah. However, um, I thought Alex initially wasn't going to go to Comic-Con, um, but then he ended up going. So I thought that the hotel situation was part, partly due to Alex suddenly coming with. Yeah. But apparently that was not the case. So, okay, so you thought the arrangements were made pre-Alex being included into the trip. Yes. Because you told me you were like, you know, it's, it's a but room for two. You were down You know, here. one of us is going to have to sit on the floor or something like that. You were down here when I was booking the shit. And that's that was, what you told me, though. You said it was a You never mentioned Alex at all. You said that you said it was a room was for two. Mentioned? No, but this was after RTX. Is there a particular and this reason? Is after we knew. Huh? Is it maybe has no to do with... No one cares. Is like Russian? Heritage? <laughs> heritage? Why were you not mentioned? Is that what you said? Yeah. 
The throng, a because, strong yeah, three of syllables. I wasn't involved with booking this? until after you were already involved with being in the trip. So I don't know what the fuck he's talking Jordan, about. Jordan, I would like to follow another. Here's how, another here's how it went here. down. Like I, I said in Skype the conversation, you were saying you were saying it's a room for two people that one of us would and still said, have to be on the floor. No, and I was like saying that. we'd have to sneak Alex in. That's what I said. I said it was only for two I don't people. That. Occupancy. Actually, I That's do remember I, that because I, saying, I said how we snuck Z into uh, yes, E3. There was never any point where I was saying it was just for us two and Alex wasn't involved. But when you say that the room was for two people, that's why I figured it was for us. But I was saying so you we were going to have a problem with Alex. Yeah, I, I was assumed. Like, assumed. I was saying I we can't let them that. find out about Alex. Hmm. But again, that makes it worse in my mind, though, yeah. showing up oh, yeah. to this place. Here's how it happened. I was helping Dan look for hotels. Yeah. There is most of the stuff was sold out and yeah. I Check figured that, that if I got something far Excuse away, me, he's flipping me off here. I'm sorry to I didn't interrupt do you. Anything. He flipped me off. He's Every time we are at a hotel that requires cab rides, it's a pain because you have to go back and forth and it's not very fun. Actually, it wasn't too bad. In the end. <laughs> okay, so it turns out to not be too bad. But anyway, <laughs> I, I found a hotel. that It's a pain look. when he's there to take cabs back and forth. There was always, like, I was thinking it was going to be hard getting a cab from the convention center, but there was always a line of cabs. You usually there. have a cab line yeah. at convention centers. Didn't we do it for uh, for PAX East? And we, we cabbed it a lot for PAX East, didn't we? Yeah, and we took the water taxi, By the way, too. why did it feel like I was always the one flagging a cab down? <laughs> We didn't. I felt like a lot. Oh, no, no, you, no, you didn't, no, no, you didn't you were flag. The, the thing was, you, yeah, you would walk up the and thing be like, was, you know, Dan would be like, okay, we gotta pick one. So no, I, I was would be like, James. okay, I was like, not okay, that one. Okay, James, <laughs> you, yeah, you, I was. I would always say, that. James, pick one, and yeah. you were always. There going are to lean cab forward. politics. You have to go to the one at the front. You do because if you go to the one behind, they'll say, why don't you take the one in the front? There's this whole. See, you can take you take the politics though, and then you also take what you think is good for your health, and you put those two together. That's why I always said, hold on, this is a different. This is a different topic. Why, I don't give a what, shit about a system they have in place. Does, no, I'm saying, does it matter? If I'm going to die with the person no, that's in the hold front, on, hold I'm on. picking the second hold on. car. <laughs> Who do you choose when it comes to cabs? Like, Someone that don't look shady. <laughs> is that now, a here's racist different question. thing? How, wh- how, what does someone have to look like to be shady? Well, first of all, there's a guy. If there's a guy sitting there like on his cell phone and stuff, and he's like sitting there like picking his nose and on his <laughs> cell phone at the same time, I'm not going with him. <laughs> I'm not going. I'm looking for someone that has like totally fair. a keen sense of like direction. attention and direction. Yeah. I guess <laughs> I wouldn't know the direction though until we're actually on the road. James, well, if he's James. if he's sitting there like dizzily, you know, shaking around while he's like sitting. I want him. Yeah, you know, he's drunk. Yeah. I want him to like he, he needs to like be looking like you know down on the has visor. The He's gonna be like this. James like. has this skill where he can look at someone and tell exactly how they're going to drive in the next twenty minutes. Yeah. yeah. It's amazing. That's an amazing. It's like a sixth Maybe sense. you should start picking cabs from now on. You can, you no, can set up it, a stand outside of a cab line and be like, you I know think what? you did a you, fine you're job. You're a family for it right there. That person looks like he's going to be okay because for Because when we got at the airport, the, the particular cab instance where I'm talking about where we needed a van <laughs> for <laughs> no, our luggage. No. Oh, that so was a nightmare. SUV pulls up. No, no, we start talking to him. These guys are like, no, we can't get in that. Start talking to the guy who's chauffeuring the taxis to bring down a van. So he goes all the way down to the end of the line. Then this guy in the front's like, no, but no, that's, now no. you can come in. So he's having this minivan drive all the way down from the end of the line to come pick us but up. But that's excusable. So you're like, no, 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 the, we'll take this one now. And I had to talk to this guy like, no, it's no, excusable, we don't need though, this minivan because that, now. That came down to our luggage. These guys want the SUV now <laughs> instead yes. of... The minivan which we had opted out for in the first place. That thing was not a fucking minivan. <laughs> that we went to was fucking sketchy. It was look, 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 look. The one that we went into, the one that was at the front of the line, that Alex was like, <laughs> you have to abide by the law and get to the They're front of the line. The, the cab law. It's, 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 Unless you want to piss a lot of people off. Like, it's <laughs> not like a minivan. It's not an SUV oh, or anything man. like that. It's a red, white, and blue little fucking like hatchback, hatchback. Mac, nasty looking <laughs> thing. And the guy is super anti to get you in there. You know, he wants you in this red, white, like and blue movie. He's, right just, he's just like taking. sitting there like, yes, American meat. The, American the meat. Yes. Not I the would. minivan. He says, pulling he up says to get us. no, you get in. <laughs> no, you get in. Right now. <laughs> like, he was getting pretty pissed. Yeah. I'm they saying, always do. Yeah. To be honest, though, like I'm saying, that if we have a lot of luggage, you know, if we feel that it's not going to fit in there, then I'm gonna go, want to go with a different. I want to go with an actual like van. There was proper reasoning to that, but you pushed it. 
You I, made us go in there. It was my fault that I Where had... the seats, the seats weren't properly formatted. I didn't push it. I it got was the as minivan. If, the it minivan was, as was as right <laughs> there pulling up. This and thing, you were I your think luggage. this It was thing, handicap this enabled, I believe thing. it was. This I think thing it, was seemingly oh made for like three I'm, wheelchair seats. Yes, yes. Because there was a shit ton of space. Between, between us and him, which is yes. a good thing. So it was like it yeah, was probably it had, no, it had no like front passenger seat. It was yeah. just all open. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. One like it was it was it was back. like his seat, wheelchair, <laughs> wheelchair, wheelchair, wheelchair. Then a row of seats for us. <laughs> this is That's a about big. It. This is a yeah. big car. It was a it was and a big to do. That was the room though, but the trunk was not as yeah, yeah. the as trunk was room. pretty yeah. small. So then he didn't want you putting your luggage on the floor. Now to, to the no, to those rules, Alex wanted this guy. He thought to there take was us. like five of us or something. So he was saying no, and then after he found out it was only three of us, he oh. was like all for it. But it was so a he big confused hassle. us on top it was of too that. late. He left the line, then got back into the line, and expected him to be the first person in the line. Wow, amazing. So, Fuck that. <laughs> well, anyway, okay, anyway, back to the hotels. Stuff. That was a new story. Back to the hotel. Uh, after taking in a few things to consideration and finding this okay hotel, I knew it wasn't going to be terrific, but it was close <laughs> enough to the <laughs> It was a one star, and Jordan, Jordan pointed this out. It was a one star? It was, was a one, it one star. Yes, it was a one star, and I pointed it out to just nobody. Okay, <laughs> no okay. to That's how much we're worth. We're worth one star. I was like, this star. is a one star, but it doesn't look that bad. One in star the out of how many? It does not look that bad. In the I, I, Four I, I was five. not aware it was a tiny room. Can they we did just not let, say it was that size of a room? Can we just let. I want to hear Jordan's perspective of this without any corrections. Okay. okay. And then we can correct okay. the shit By out the way, of it. I, I just can't wait to get knows the part where we pull about. up to the hotel. <laughs> if nobody knows what we're talking about, there's a video for the yeah, first the, day yeah, of the yeah, worst hotel room ever. ever. Yeah, for the first Comic Con day, yeah, where we take a tour of this awesome room. I don't know if there's going to be You can uh, see it for yourself. Is there going to be a link for it or something in the description at least or if he remembers? Yeah. If 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 Dan remembers. If not, <laughs> just go <laughs> If not, just go on the hub search. and search West yeah. Coast Hotel, Hotel remember. and remember. There's a playlist for it anyway somewhere. for all the stuff. In the yeah. Comic-Con stuff. So anyway, uh, it it looked like an okay hotel. It I didn't see anywhere where it said one bedroom room that was tiny. It's just like, okay, this is the one of the only hotels in the vicinity of the convention center that's not four or five hundred dollars a night. Let's just get this one. But it was though. It ended up being like four hundred dollars a night. No. It ended up being like twelve hundred dollars. After you guys went to the other one. No, that no. was no, the total. actual the that actual was one the ended up being... that was the total at the front desk. Damn. It ended up being more than what the it one was we on went to. Line. The so one we went to swindled. afterwards that cost is swindling. The one we went to afterwards cost less. That than is the one. swindling. You if they to charge you hotel? more for that. Well, the well, idea, the idea hotel. was yeah, we, went to, uh, uh, we didn't stay one night in that. Hotel. No, <laughs> we didn't. Really? No. Damn. No. We both, oh, okay, well, hold on. Listen, listen, listen. The um, I didn't know that. I can't even fucking remember what I was gonna say now. I was trying. As far as like it being, <laughs> I was to say it. okay. I was so to say I saw a price for this hotel online. I was like, Dan, this is this looks like okay. this, is this, is <laughs> this, this is the one. This is the one. Oh yeah, and the one hotel. The, day, and the I was reason like, Dan, we picked it. The reason we picked that one was because it wasn't necessarily well. It was price within vicinity within walking it was distance like less of the convention than a mile, center. It was like a mile or less. From it's the not that ones center. that were further away wouldn't be cheaper. It was just that we wanted the walking distance as opposed to cabbing it every single day. Yeah. So that's why, distance. like, <laughs> because I've always <laughs> had. I just got <laughs> off of like Jordan was. I was saying, or we could get one then cab it, and Jordan was like, no, we'll walk. Like you guys can walk a mile, which was fine. Like, and I was oh, like, okay, we can walk a mile. We can, Jordan. We can sure walk a mile. <laughs> You, you were there. Walked a mile. You walk a I mile. I walked a mile. Shoes over Jordan, there. Jordan, Jordan, yeah, I was like, "How far is that?" Because we're gonna be doing cosplay one of the days, and uh, and he was he was like, "It's about the distance it was from our hotel in Los Angeles to the E3? metro or whatever. Like it was that that size walk." And I was like, "Okay, that's not too bad." The you know the one we like, saw the blood three trail. Blocks or so. Four it's blocks. Not that far. It was like from from when we went up. We went up to like the strip and then yeah, like a block down and like a block to the strip. So it's two or that was two, two blocks, blocks down. That was like two or three blocks down. Yeah, yeah. So two or three. Once blocks again, total. once again. Anyway, it was one block down. It, it was, was one block up, and you were there. That was it. One foot out the hotel, you were practically <laughs> at the metro. <laughs> 
it's no wonder why this Either happened. Way. At least in our check when we walked out of the hotel, the convention yeah, center was, was right, right there. there. So I figured, like, I, I went along with it, and I was like, yeah, that seems fine. I mean, if anything, it's going to be like... He looked at pictures, too. And I looked at a picture. More, like, I looked decent. at a picture, and I'm like, okay, that looks small, but I guess we'll make it work. If anything, it's like the Milner, and it'll be a funny video. This <laughs> was a funny yeah. video. Next time you do this, this has to go through more than just Dan. <laughs> this has to go through, like, two other parties. If you guys want to be around and book it, that's This is, this is the fine. funny part. None of these guys will ever take part in booking because they don't want to be held responsible I for had to book stuff. me and him had to book our way out of that stupid hotel <laughs> that true. night at like 12 a.m. we were like can we call somebody can we go online like is there anything just, we can do to get out all I know is I got a call at like midnight <laughs> and I hear James just like hey we're not even at sleep. to that part, point yet we shouldn't fast forward I'm doing my side of the story like okay. You guys can get to your side. That's a, like that's my experience, and I saw the video go up, and it was hilarious. I just kept laughing when James called me because I because I had no idea it would be that bad, and that's just kind of what happens sometimes. Like with the Milner, stuff looks different. I just online. love our filter. Like our filter is like you know this looks small. Well, it's Milner status. We can make a good video. I didn't think that. That was Dave. That's what I thought. <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> You put us in jeopardy, dude. <laughs> like major jeopardy. Okay, well, like getting okay, so off at the hotel. The we driver flew, was we, like, "Are okay. you sure you we guys want to get off?" Did he really here? say that? Yeah, he was like looking around, like, "I think this is the place." <laughs> hold on, he, hold like, on, hold on, he stopped, hold on. and then he went a little bit forward. He was like, "This isn't, this isn't the right place." Yeah, this hold, is, hold on. Is, oh, I don't hold know. like a bad name. You're ruining like, the story. Here. Yeah. Okay, so. The whole cab thing happened. We ended up pulling up, and it's like this janky, really ghetto area, and we're just like, what the hell? <laughs> and we, he, he ends up stopping, and yeah, like, like Alex said, this is the place? And it was like, we're like, oh my god, I hope it's not that place. Well, the thing was, we looked to the right, and we seen there's, a, there's one next door, and we were like, no, this isn't the right place. It's like, oh, you thank god. You look down, like, right next to it, yeah. this is the place. <laughs> yeah, oh. it was like... It, we saw, we saw this one place, and we're like, oh, God, that can't be the place. Okay, oh, good. It's a little bit further down. The one that was actually ours that was further down looked ten times worse <laughs> than the place that we, at, like that was right next to it. And Because it didn't have any light. It didn't have a sign. It just said West Park Inn. It wasn't lit up. It was like a gated entrance. And we're like, what oh, is this, man. an alleyway? Like, what's, what is this? <laughs> Make a and good video. So, uh, we're sitting I here like, I was going to die. Like, everybody's laughing. Everybody's life laughing. At that point. Like, we're like, what the fuck? Like, this is it? And then... All of a sudden, as we're getting our bags and shit, we hear <laughs> a fucking plane is like landing on our hotel. <laughs> the planes fly right <laughs> over the hotel. So close, to and him. I couldn't. I couldn't. I was laughing so hard because it was just like, oh my god, what is? This? Dan was either like Dan's situation was he was either laughing or saying how he's all right with it. <laughs> <laughs> Like, Dan was all right with it, mind you. I would have. I would have stuck the it video. Out. Dan was all right. I would have stuck it out. Uh, Meanwhile, me and Alex were sitting there half in tears. <laughs> I had to call Jordan right when we got there. And I, I was like, like, Jordan, help me! Jordan, help us! We're gonna die! I could not believe I that is what my life had succumbed to. I was, was like, I was like, Jordan, do you know about this hotel that you put for us? <laughs> I started to regret when I got to the San Diego airport because of like all the construction that's inside. Oh, yeah, it was of it. like that last time too. Yeah, but we then when like, we got to that hotel, <laughs> yeah, I started Alex was, regretting Alex was a pretty lot much of done things. with the trip on the t- cab ride over. Like, <laughs> and then we got to the hotel. San Diego was, was a nice place. He was it's not so too done. bad. I just like, I hate flying, and like I was uh, already like <laughs> done with flying when I got off. All I know <laughs> is I got a phone call. I laughed. Because they're like, help us, help us. And I'm like, once I get, let me, I was just about to go to bed too. So I'm like, I'm going to just go and lay down in my nice comfy bed. You guys have a great night. He's like, he's like, he sounds like he's exhausted, but he's, he's not exhausted enough to like, you know, he just laughs his ass out. off. Like he's sitting there like, I'm like, Jordan, do you know about this hotel? Like. This hotel really fucking sucks. <laughs> he just immediately starts laughing, and I'm no, like, Jordan, it? Jordan, this isn't a joke. I was like, this is really fucking bad. It stinks like shit in here. I was oh like, yeah, that the bathroom. Bed, the bed is so small. I was like, it, it's it, terrible. It was actually a motel. That was not a hotel. That was. It was much. an inn. It wasn't was a motel. Inn. Okay, that's the, the West same Park Inn in San Diego avoided at all costs. There's an extended you know, had, stay in you know, had the stuff. elevator in it. Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So I heard about the elevator. We took that one time and we were talking. I, 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 I went back yeah, down. They, we took they, the they, stairs. For some like reason, all you our guys, luggage. 
you five found, floors of stairs you to guys, avoid that elevator. You guys found the elevator terrifying for some reason. I took it down. They walked five flights of stairs to get down. And I took the <laughs> elevator. It was completely elevator. worth it. <laughs> what was wrong was with like, it? It was it, as it was going up. It was like, <laughs> it came like to a like, it came to like one of those like abrupt stops where oh, like, yeah. it, <laughs> it like passes its its point oh, of destination okay. and then comes back down for a split <laughs> second. So it's like <laughs> <laughs> it was like oh. no, not happening. <laughs> Oh, the, to get into the like, you check Damn. in, and they give you a security passcode to open the gated door <laughs> to get into the actual place. Like, <laughs> it was shady. Oh. I was like, Jordan, is there anything you can do in your power to get us out of here? Yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean no? I started laughing more. <laughs> I just well, started reason, laughing. The reason why I wanted to stick it out was because we already had paid for the hotel. <laughs> and I wasn't sure we could get a refund. Yeah, you and said when you go through like price line and stuff, it's harder. I, I yeah. figured like if anything, you could get it there. If but you fight I could for do. the fucking refund, you will get it. If you fight hard enough, <laughs> well, no, there is a box that smells like fucking puke and shit. In your closet, did you then, bring that down or something? <laughs> what? No, I didn't. Oh, I just, I just smell this. <laughs> it's like, no, I went out of here. <laughs> I thought you would have brought it down. Like, do you smell this? This is what we're no, dealing with. Actually, we yeah, I, I broke their, like, uh. He broke the screen window. Uh, wow. They, they locked me out of the room. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> the, the door was open when you went to go do that <laughs> shit. No, no. You what? locked me out of the room, so I was trying to find a way in. Uh, you're so, you're so, you're so full of shit. Yeah. He was standing in the doorway telling well, you to yeah, come well, inside. I mean, when I started oh, breaking I it. locked it after when you started, started doing that shit, it, asshole. Like, <laughs> no, because you locked me out. I said, oh, I'll find your way in. You oh, broke that's... a door? No, I... It was, he he broke he's the sitting window. there for whatever reason, okay? We're sitting there. I'm trying he to get out the laptop to get us the <laughs> fuck out of here. <laughs> you know, Dan was just sitting there, like, on the bed. I'm okay with this. He's just like, you know, I'm fine with this, whatever, man. No, this I'm just like, whatever. if they wanted... Yeah, I was. Just, my position was, <laughs> if we could get a refund, I'm absolutely fine with going somewhere else. If not, I don't want to waste all the hub money. On getting another hotel and shit like that, and so I you, felt like yeah. I felt bad about like going with you guys if you guys were gonna be the one that ended, that ended up paying for the room. I'm gonna like we did get to the point where we said we'd split a fucking room together. Yeah, and like I could, <laughs> I can't <laughs> afford to split a room, so I'm like, okay, what am I gonna do? We like, were like, that's no so just stay there by yourself. Yeah, <laughs> and I didn't want to do that. So. <laughs> stay there by oh, yourself. Did we that up? Yeah, yeah like, you guys did bring up that option. Like, I'm the fucking. And stuff. I, was like, <laughs> I was like, if we're getting, if you guys are getting another room, I'm not staying here. He's alright with it, but he don't want to stay there. Stay here if you guys are leaving. That would have been a funny video. But he was like, I was doing this on a Day laptop, one. and he was he was just here. he was just laying there. He was just like you know hanging out or whatever. And then you went outside for whatever reason to pick with the fucking like. And I was the, just like, the, what are you the doing? screen or whatever. Dan was like, what's he doing? And then he opens the door and stands in the doorway. What are you doing, Alex? Come back inside. <laughs> Breaking shit outside. Alex, come inside. And then me across the room. Alex, what the fuck are you doing? Get inside. Yeah, you were trying <laughs> to figure out. That's not, that's not how I remember it. That's, I how, that, that's remember, how I remember it. That's how I remember it. I specifically remember you he comes in. He comes I in did lock room. you out. After you were already fucking fiddling with that shit and broke it. And then he comes in the room. He comes in the room with black shit all over his hands. He's like, I think I broke something. <laughs> Uh, Were you like trying to steal something from the bottom of a car? Oh, or what something? the fuck he was trying to do? Going under a car, <laughs> like taking out a car. No, I was trying to get back into the room, and I was like, <laughs> no. taking off the screen. No. It covers the room, and I no. ended up breaking it. But then the window was closed. And the the side fact side. that this scenario is going on in your head, <laughs> as opposed to what actually happened, Jesus has some kind of imagery of him like trying to get. The all fact these that tools he felt that he was locked out, out while Dan was standing through. in the doorway. I didn't doorway. want to be locked out. Like it was really sketchy. They're hammering on the door. Maybe he was just he he felt so oppressed there that he felt like he was locked out when he really <laughs> like wasn't. A, I feel like a trapped animal. He was already starting to get paranoid. <laughs> yeah, his paranoia is just taking oh over and th God. this is the only it way the to smell. go forward. Do you blame me though? Do you blame my <laughs> paranoia though? Uh, so we shame. take all of our shit, we take all of our shit inside, we see this room and we're immediately, hell no, there's no <laughs> way. Dan says someone could sleep on the floor. Two no, I said I would sleep on the floor. He's, He's, well, yeah, you said you would sleep on the floor, and then he also said two people take the bed. That bed, no fucking way that's happening on that bed. That was like... It was it was a Probably twin, a twin. Bed. It, it was, was a twin, twin bed. I there saw was it no the way that was oh happening. There was no the way space between the down bed down. and the bathroom door was probably like three feet. <laughs> then there's a little table. There's an actually an all right TV that was there. Yeah, that, that's was a like nice, the TV. nice TV. <laughs> we plop all of our stuff down. Immediately they go in and check the bathroom, and I guess the bathroom was a mix of a bathroom and a kitchen <laughs> because it had Which, a. 
It had a uh, whatchamacallit. Uh, it had a fridge, a, fridge. a microwave, the sink across the from the toilet disposal. had a garbage disposal yeah. built into it. And like in the video, I'm like, what? There's a garbage disposal right across from the toilet. And people are like, well, that's I never seen a garbage disposal before. Like, <laughs> no, there I is. thought the smell was coming for because like just yeah. thinking about all that, I thought like something rotted in there. Well, you guys like, don't know. No, immediately when we opened that door, we were like, oh, <laughs> <laughs> what smell? Something stinks really bad. <laughs> so then like. We were fucking around with each other. <laughs> Everyone was going inside and smelling it, blah, blah, blah. And then we came back out. And then I went back in, like, I think to, like, legit take a piss in that horrible place. <laughs> and I, I, I started investigating what, what the smell was. And there's this little container. It's probably the, the ice bucket. Next, the ice yeah, bucket. It, it looked like something I, yeah, like that. I think it, it was, was next the to the, uh, the coffee uh, thing. And it was closed. Slightly kind of, like, cracked so that, you know, something. I, I don't know why I opened it. <laughs> I opened it up. You were trying to find the source of the smell. This gust of <laughs> stank shit. Stank. The gust of vomit shit. Like old urine. It all came out <laughs> Aged all at once. urine. And it was just like, it hit me in the face. And I was like. like a chamber pot, they were saying. <laughs> I was like, oh my god. I came outside and I was like, I know what the smell is. I know what the smell is, but by this time, the smell was leaking out into the room. <laughs> so it was like, go go inside and smell this. <laughs> and the video did, it. like, picks up. He's like, oh, is it this thing? <laughs> I cut it out. I actually cut out my reaction because I couldn't really smell it. Like I couldn't, I couldn't smell it so much. I well, smelled he did. it a when little I bit. Shoved it in his face. It he did, fucking the, smelled the it. smell. Must have already. I pulled out whenever you shove anything in my face, it's like the, especially if you're like, oh, this smells like shit here. Like, the smell <laughs> should have like, just. Oh really? The smell Ooh, probably just spread yeah. everywhere else because when I sniffed yeah. it, I didn't smell any more concentrated from that. So after that, the smell was all around the room. And at this point, before it was, let's get out of here. At this point, it was, we got to get the fuck out of here right now. <laughs> James is like, get a headache and shit. There is no way I'm going to withstand the night. Yeah, I already had a headache and everything from the smell. We were hungry. Like, we got to get the fuck out of here. And we booked it out of there. There yeah. was no way. So like, I, I went down to the, like, the clerk guy. And I was like, yeah, we're going to check out. And like he was like, okay, room thing. And I'm sure he well, pulled up the thing and saw that we checked after in After a little bit, because you didn't originally before. want to do it. You were like, I don't want to do I, that. I don't I like was doing just that like, kind of stuff. I, well, it was better that it wasn't the same person checking out as it was checking in because it was the same lady. They, still, they kind of, still, they said like the guy was really. Old. They acted like as if they get this shit all the time. Yeah. <laughs> they probably do. The guy was like, "I'm going to charge you for the night, but since you're not saying the full thing, it's we're like, going to refund you." I don't give the... a shit about being cordial in this situation. <laughs> you got this shit smell in this room. I'm not staying in it. Give me a fucking yeah, refund. Yeah. I'm out of here. Like, there's yeah. no fucking way. There's no easy way wow. to put it. I'm just not like. I'm not a like. Uh, I can't do that. I'm, I don't usually. I don't. I do would that. yell at them. I, w I should have brought it down with me. It's like, you smell this? You know, at this, at this point, this. it doesn't smell in here anymore. It's up in the fucking room. <laughs> so go in the room. It all fucking came out and went in the room. <laughs> so it's like an said, ancient evil was released in the room when he opened it. <laughs> <laughs> when he opened it. Bill Spirit comes out. Spirit of shit smell comes out. It's going to haunt some other Just invest and haunts that room. <laughs> so Alex ended up booking a hotel that was like uh, 20 minutes away or so from the convention center we, we we got the guy who checked us out to order a cab and i forgot to ask him to specifically to order a van cab so we were kind of <laughs> oh. like we didn't know if we would that be able fun. to fit our stuff in there and so he was like it should be about five minutes or something like that like 20 minutes later and after seven cabs drove by us <laughs> um our cab showed up and we luckily were able to fit everything in there we went to the the new hotel and which Uber. was infinitely better um, and uh, they actually had, luckily enough, we got there um, in time to order food from, I guess, a place they, they oh have boy. order out. Yeah, it wasn't that from, great. Yeah, I saw asshole. the bill for that. How much was the bill for that? <laughs> oh, it was hefty. Was okay. There's a bunch of hefty bills Listen, on that. We, on that. We I just sit there. The when they garage. go to events, I just sit there and watch be the bank watch account. Watch the bank statement. And I things. just see, like, what is ching, what? Ching, what is ching, ching, and when ching, I saw, ching, like, ching. the refunding and, like, charging for the hotels, like, going all over the place, I was like, oh, man. By the way, I'm still waiting for my refund for the tickets, too. I'm still waiting for that. Thank you. For what? For the tickets. Oh, let, let me, let me, sorry. Put that on there. Uh, Put that on there. Refund. Yeah. Thank James. You. Yeah. James. Ah, uh, thank you. Tickets. Yes. Sorry. Sorry about that. Sorry. You didn't, but I think you was, didn't was, this the, was this the day of the fucking food shit? Where uh, this no. asshole kept going about this food? 
Was that food? the day when we went? There, when we got there? I'm really hungry. Food fiasco? No, that was no, that was no, that was that was a different night. That it was, was a like if you're, if you're hungry out there and you want to pitch in on this hunger conversation, I'm pretty hungry. To, I don't know if you guys. Can we order like a pizza. Or no, something? we did. We did get. We got like from this place. Do you want me to order food right now? Yeah. We want, what do we want? want We're going to order food right now live on Creature Talk, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> never, right? never before can we order some pizza or something. Should I capture the screen what, what so what we, we can... Uh, you guys have order? eaten pizza like three days out of the week. I'm actually eating pizza. I'm starving. I'm actually Jesus. eating pizza tonight, so I'll order something different from... Oh, well, do they have like a Chinese place or <laughs> something? No, I'm going to order Yeah, Domino. they do. I'll order Domino. You can call them. You guys want. Yeah. <laughs> you have a menu over there. Dude, oh, yeah, you can call them. get some Chinese. Oh, that's the place I eat from, actually. I saw that menu. That's the place I eat from. I'll pick something out and we can order some Chinese food here. Just don't tell don't tell the credit card number over the phone. <laughs> yeah, say it over the phone loud and clear. <laughs> I don't have any cash, so. Is this the same place as cash? before? It's on Alex. He this a different no, place. that one's too what far. It's a different place. just volunteer for it. <laughs> yeah, you did. Yeah, You're like, cash. oh, sweet, man. Where's your menu? <laughs> We're going to a hard rock, right? Yeah. We're going to a hard rock cafe in Seattle, right? Yeah. Yeah. We I should. told you we're going to it. I right. promised you. There wasn't, there wasn't a hard rock in San Diego that we went to. We I promised them. We Seattle. didn't go to one. I don't know if there was one. <laughs> I promised. Oh, them the streak Seattle. continued. By the way, the streak continued uh, on the way to San Diego. That was restarted from RTX. What are you or, looking for? Was it RTX or E3? Where's the menu? Oh, no, where you go? Oh, okay. Where's the what? Would you find someone else again at an airport? Yeah, like we have a way, what we call a streak. Whenever a fan meets us at the airport, like it. James kind of and I met a on. fan, uh, or we met a fan at uh, for Pax East going through. Nashville. Oh, really? Did we have one at? Oh, someone though? tweeted me a picture of that playset at the Nashville airport. They're like, I'm passing <laughs> through Nashville. Look what I found. The landmark. Did you guys? Um, uh, did we did we meet somebody at E3 for E3 or was it RTX that it got started back um, up? I don't think we had. If one for we E3. went to E3. It was E three the one we were like eating, and while we were eating, our flight was boarding, and he came and say hi to us. someone came and say hi to us. I can't remember though, so I don't think so. It all just kind of. I think it started together. back up with RTX, and then we had another one for uh, another fan come up and hang out with us for a good little bit because he was he was on the same flight. He was going to Comic Con too. Oh okay. So he hung out with us for a little bit, and we were talking. He didn't really know who I was, or did he, he knew you a little bit? And then it was, he, so he, it was mainly James, James's. Yeah, yeah he, he had watched or whatever. And he only seemed to watch like some of James's stuff, not a lot of it. So, uh, but what, what is he doing over there anyway? Looking to see if this is the right place. Oh, if, okay. if, it, yeah, that's it. Well, that's the place I usually order from. There was like a, a random dude with him at the was airport. Was that his dad? Was like I don't know I don't who that think was. So. Was this his guardian? <laughs> like the guy like, seemed to be with him. Like we met the kid, and then the guy like came over, like he was a part of him. Yeah. Like, but he was asking for. Hey, nice to meet you guys. We're like, yeah, like okay. he's a big fan of yours. He's like his dad or something. I and then, maybe. Like, he but left. He, he backed off. Well, he asked us if there was a laptop charger or like yeah, a yeah, charger yeah. station <laughs> around there, As and then he had a booking it and like never came back. Maybe yeah. he ended up leaving him there. The kid left, and the guy was still there. <laughs> so like literally, this <laughs> guy came, came over, <laughs> said hi. Hey, is there a laptop? Maybe thing that here? kid didn't hey, know who nice he was and just didn't say anything because like he was confused. But that happens. Like people will see like. Like when I was like when I had my Boston meetup, like people would come over and like yeah. ask me for a picture or something, and then Before, afterwards they'd be yeah. like, "Who is that? Like, who is this person? <laughs> like they have no idea who they got a picture with." Wow. So I figured like maybe this guy was just like, see this kid come up to him and he's like, "Oh, the you guys," and he's like, "Hey, nice to meet you guys. Must be is so there a famous." Laptop charger over here. <laughs> <laughs> maybe he just wanted to ask just, and just randomly. Yeah. F- he know. saw his, his he saw his window, it but was uh, it was weird. Yeah. So okay, where are we going from there? Uh, food day one day one we were talking much, about yeah. the food fiasco well think, but food was fiasco like, was a couple was days later day, right? yeah oh, okay. it was, so it was like one. day before last i see day one dash behemoth <clears throat> okay so day one was our our first day bring that over of, here um bring that over here Can I pick one first? bring that over here and pick it over here write it down on a list if you're gonna pick one. Oh. i'll take just an order of crab cheese wontons crab cheese wontons i'm not ordering it don't tell me <laughs> you volunteered to order it. What? Don't tell me. Tell him. He's running it down. <laughs> Don't tell me. Tell him. One order of crab cheese wontons, I've sir. On another creature to talk about. Did you hear about his wontons? O- o- he requires one order Oxford? of crab cheese wontons. You don't call them ragoons here? Crab rangoon? Yeah. They they call them well. It's it's, it's wontons e- on the menu, but they call it either, either rangoons or wontons. Or wontons. wontons. Like at Panda Express, they call it uh, rangoons, but like if oh. you say wonton, they know what it is. Yeah. I don't know. You guys give me a lot of shit for for General Gao's chicken. Yeah. What? 
Okay, so he's in general. <laughs> okay, and this wasn't in the video, unfortunately. The mayonnaise was, but not General Gao. No, I cut out General Gao's chicken just in case he was right of it actually being a thing and us making fun of him for it. I Gow. thought there was. I want to know because I, I I've like, never heard general. I'm sure I've there is. Place. General I know. Gow, but... I know. Tsao's I is think a thing, no Tsao's and gals. gals. I think there is a gals. Okay, and it's like the same thing. Like that's. That's why, why I, I cut it out of the video. I always get confused. I'm like, I don't want to order the wrong general crab. Like, what if I don't like? This general's food, and I keep ordering it. What if, what if they think you're supporting this general? Yeah, they'll be like, <laughs> yeah, the oh, like gals. General, yeah, general, yeah. Tsao, general Tsao is a lot more, you know, politically correct to order. <laughs> general Gao, he was, he was a little iffy. So if you say like General Gao, at general a place, Gao's and they're like, his finger during cooking is. We don't food. serve that here. <laughs> you get out. <laughs> <laughs> we don't support him. <laughs> general Tsao forever. Oh, wow. um, Tsao's lots for of life. educated talk here. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, mayonnaise. So, so crab cheese one was the tons. behemoth. Crab cheese one time. <clears throat> um, so one, no, day one was yeah, like just write it down day one was like one of uh, two days oh, we oh had to really God. explore the floor by ourselves um, without having to do anything really. Um, so that was the day we like filmed the uh, the Xbox One uh, versus PS4 headphones thing oh. and the Manny people's. El Luchador thing, and uh, I got to play Arkham Origins. Uh, I got some hands on with that, and that was pretty fun. I didn't end up been doing a that night. I didn't end up getting to record my impressions like I wanted to, and I never got around to it during the trip. But that night, I had a lot of time to. <laughs> I'm just staring at Alex while I'm saying this. Um, but yeah, I got oh. to play Arkham Origins. It was it was really it was uh, really good, and I thought it 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 looks good despite James wanting me to hate it for some reason. I don't want you to hate it. You want me to be worried about it. It's it's like a... It's it's a cash-in. It's Arkham... I... It is a cash-in. From everything I've seen, though... It's not. It is a cash-in. They was, took, they it's took, no, it, I see it as no different from like the shit they do for Assassin's Creed. Like, and Assassin's no Creed, a lot of people are getting up in arms about it too. It's the same Jordan, shit. Jordan's it is the fine. same shit. He I'd just say like, like yeah, Brotherhood, yeah. Brotherhood and Revelations. Yeah, that's kind of. Yep. They, they they're getting the same way. Like, recycled yeah. and whatnot. But I, I think nothing will ever top ODST. That's really good game. <laughs> anyway, I don't know. I'm excited. I'm excited for Origins for the story, and the story looks pretty good so far. So. They, yeah, I don't that know. It does. I mean, that's that's the only thing I really care about. If they reuse gameplay, I don't give a shit. But um, well, I mean, for a lot of people, they want an advancement on. No, I I, I completely understand that. In a proper that. sequel, I understand. Even that you argument. were saying, man, they reskinned a heavy to just be the same shit. <laughs> oh, he's not reskinned, but yeah, it's the same yeah. thing. They just they, like oh, slightly man. modified it, where it's like they added some armor onto the heavy, and so you have to take off the armor, and then like he was crazy hard when I was fighting him in Origins. So he I liked how I just like the fact that he kept talking about how hard these one enemies were, and then he just walked up and just destroyed them <laughs> in the demo. Yeah, when he was. Um, doing that. But uh, yeah, so we did all that. We got to hang out at the Behemoth booth for a little bit and talk to those guys. James and uh, Alex were uh, doing that and such. Yeah, we got to meet the uh, the artist as well as the Sand Paladin. Yep. Yeah. John yep. Baez. Yep. Um, we enough. pretty much met almost all. Uh, yeah, of them. We pretty much point. met everybody. Like that night, uh, James and Alex were invited to uh, their tenth uh, anniversary um, behemoth party, which is awesome to like actually be able to go to like a a company party. Like, because like, like, like they consider themselves, they're not they they the way like uh, like Dan had put it, they're not indie, but they're not big studio. They're about twenty people. That's like, and they're fine with that. They're, they're Behemoth is obviously, by the way, like Castle Crashers. Yeah, yeah, Battle Block, Battle Block, Battle Block, Battle Block, Block. Yeah. yeah, but like they're they're like right in the middle, like on a, on like a middle ground, and it's just like I guess they just found like a good sweet spot where it's like they're completely fine with all that. But like to go to like their tenth anniversary thing, considering we just did like. The battle block videos that was really cool because yeah. we got to see like all of them there. Yeah, and I don't, I didn't really have any connection with them outside of you know just being at Comic Con with you guys. So we I got, got you in though. I it was awesome to hang out those those guys are really cool. Well, I mean I had I, the only person I really had a connection with was Josh who I did the Bat Dance video with at RTX. He was the guy I ended up trying to recruit recruit to be Robin, and so then he he made a return in I the know if I Bat Dance and Robins video. No, he knows. So he's in, Josh is in both of those, and he's a really cool guy. He's funny. It's funny to bounce stuff off with. Just keeps going. There's never an end point. <laughs> like, I, I ended up cutting a lot of the stuff out with him. But, uh, yeah. So, 
the behemoth. So we didn't really get cool. to do. We didn't do too much during the day, other than I mean, we stopped by their booth. We got you guys got these uh, posters or whatever. The Stan Lee thing. Oh, yeah, yeah. We met a couple fans in front of that print shop that James wanted to look at, and uh, they had posters, um, uh, it, well, these prints of Stan Lee. Um, I could actually probably go grab it. It's probably in the other room, still in your tube, and show it to the camera. Yours might be. I don't know. Alex took his out. Yeah, so mine should still be in there. I don't know what he did, but yours is still in there. Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Well, maybe um, probably is still there. I'll go grab that in a second. But, like, they had these prints that uh, were – that. They were 150 bucks, and it has like different like variations of Stanley throughout like you know his history doing comics and stuff like that, and characters he created like Spider Man and Hulk and stuff like that, and it guaranteed you if you got the print to skip to the head of the line um, for a signing that he was doing like Saturday and Sunday, so or Friday Saturday no just Friday and Saturday I think, um, so. <laughs> I wanted to, one, no meet caps. Stan Lee and also get a signature on that print because I thought the print looked pretty cool. So uh, we, Alex and I both, well, Alex bought one, and then I was like, I want to get kind of get one too. So I got one because, one, I wanted to be able to potentially film if we could film um, meeting him, uh, and so that way I could go up with Alex. Um, but I also wanted one. So what, what are you doing there? Oh, the, the camera. camera. I thought you were doing something like Seamus over there. <laughs> um <laughs> So yeah, so we got My those. Turn? And we got to meet the we got, Stan Lee we, himself. We, we got to well, we'll wait until <laughs> we get to that day. At least that's what you day. thought. Hold on, it. <laughs> we'll, we'll we'll wait until the we get to Saturday. Himself. We'll wait Up until we get to personal Saturday. close counter experience. Yeah, yeah. So we're teasing. so anyway. I mean, we else? went besides wontons. No, I just wanted the wontons. We did the uh, so after day one on the floor. Uh, yeah, we went back to behemoth you know, the, party. The, the, the behemoth, behemoth party. party, which it was bowling and. Bowling, cousin. Like, I wanted to get back to the hotel that night to because I had a lot. Of, I wanted to get stuff from day one edited, and uh, we didn't end up getting back until like one o'clock in the morning. And we didn't end up being able to really edit anything the first day, which was quite disappointing for me because I wanted, <laughs> I wanted to get shit done. <laughs> like, at E3, at E3, we had so many, like, we had two or three videos going up a day, and we had like almost 20 videos total, like, going up the entire time. And there was only like two or three left over when I got back. And now there's a few left over, but I've been working on so many other things for the hub that we haven't had time to even get to those that are time sensitive. So, like, uh, yeah, so that was the first day. Yeah, it was a uh, fun. You're going to tell fun. about how you scolded us? Uh, do, you, do, you, do you want me to tell you how you I sc scolded us? Alex asked me if I was going to bring this up. I don't give a shit. You, you yelled at us. I did yell at those two. That's good. I was very disappointed. That's good. Well, That's the, good. okay, the thing was, okay, so Friday was the day we allotted to do panels. And the only way we were going to get into panels... Was it Friday? Yes, it was Friday. Thursday was the first day. Friday uh, was the day we were going to uh, do panels. So the only way I figured we were going to do panels is if we went out to three, like at 3 o'clock in the morning to the convention center to camp Damn. out to do panels. And... You know, I said I would do it by myself if I needed to. Those guys didn't necessarily have to come, but I wanted them to come because we do impressions videos for the hub afterwards, which we didn't end up doing anyway. Um, <laughs> wow. Um, well, but well, we'll talk about it on here. I think that was the main point of them saying they wanted to go to the panels instead of being on the floor. Yeah, but so what are you doing? disappointing. <laughs> so, but the first disappointing. What disappointing? Anyway, Why? on okay. So Why? Thursday, Thursday when we we checked in. Um, a fan came up whose mother works at the convention center. Uh -oh. Who we seen last year. Who we did meet last year. And he, he just walked up to me and he was like, hey, Dan, like, you know, uh, like, you know, do you want this bag? And it was a Batman bag, like Adam West Batman bag. And the one they gave me was like Teen Titans or something like that. Or no, it was a different show that I didn't really care for. Uh, and so, like, he was like, hey, Batman bag. I was like, oh, that's awesome. And so, like, we were talking and... He was like, if there's anything you guys need or anything, and I think James said, you know, can you get us into Hall H? Mm. And he was like, yeah, I can do that. <laughs> and yeah. I was like, without waiting in line or anything? I was like, yeah, yeah, I could, I could do that. Like, and I was like, He's promising uh, the world. He's like, and yeah, I'm like, uh, well, I mean, okay, we want to do that tomorrow. What would we have to do to get in? And he's like, well, the hall opens at like 10, so be here at like 930. And I was like, Okay. <laughs> Swindled you out of line. Man. So that's kind of scary. Bam so we, so like the the three o'clock in the morning plan ended up going out the window. So it's like okay, we can go actually sleep and then go to the the place. Sorry, I'm sorry to interrupt you. 
You order the <laughs> same fucking thing as me. No, Every goddamn at me. time at we me. get anything. Always the same shit. You know shit. what's funny? Every time we go out to eat and they have raspberry iced tea, I try to say it first so that way he says, he has to say like, well, Whatever two you... of those. <laughs> I'm always the two of those guys. <laughs> He's yeah. always that guy yeah. that they're like, damn, mm. you copied him. Wow. <laughs> no, that's no, too no, no, unoriginal. No, it's, it's, that's fine. It's, that's fine all, but I all have right. to say it every single time. Every single time. I could switch this up. Panda right Express, now. he comes in, General Chow's, Lo Main, and this. I said General Gal. Or, you know, we got. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so the 3 o'clock anyway, in the morning. He's writing down the same fucking thing as I am. In the same, like. He's not done. He's he's using the same capital it's letters same as format. I am. It's in the and same I put, format. like, a like a with. Like, a slash with. Yeah. He's doing the exact same fucking thing. Yeah. It's like the same. <laughs> yes. Yeah. I can pick Are you some. gonna get the same side order as me too? I'm just wondering. I, that's what I'm waiting for. I'm see. He's, he's he's looking too, and he knows he wants that, I'm but he doesn't want to put it down. I've actually never had that, so if I do you it, I just I just is that, is that like a side? You can do a side of that. I I'm guessing like they didn't really say you could do a side. Otherwise, I just hmm. don't want a bunch of, like fucking chicken with nothing there. Like they don't they give you rice. Oh rice. This is why we don't order food during creature talk. Yeah, I wonder why we've never done this before. <laughs> He well, just keeps staring I kind of want me. pork lo mein too as a side. Oh, yes. We'll figure out the pork lo mein situation, but so far... Pork lo mein's pretty good. So now we have three orders of pork lo mein. pork lo mein's pretty good. What if I put one? I yeah. can vouch for okay, that. that. It, it, be, it, I don't want like a massive order of pork lo mein. It's, it's going to be a massive order, I feel like. Why would you get two entrees then? That's you not get, an entree. You get, you get two cu- Pork lo mein's things. not an entree, is it? Yeah, it is. Well, it's, it's pork lo mein is an entree for them. You're getting two meals? He's getting no. two meals. Jesus. You're getting two this, this meals. There. I, just, I just figured you're it's a side. You're getting two Jeez, meals. I don't even you know serious? if they have it. It isn't a side. Listen, uh, if I'm paying for this right now, you can't give me shit. paying for it. Yeah, that's that, the whole that thing. But point. when you tell them, you can't say with, you know, Why can't he do that the card? as a side. Why can't he do the card? Because he offered to pay. Oh, well. So I'm he... over here getting scolded again. <laughs> Again, I'm not scolding you. I'm saying it's an entree. I'm where's not doing shit. The, where does it say what? Oh, the what is? This is like See, completely like derailed. Right here. Oh, this is that's done. That's a, that's a full well, take a well, they're figuring this out. Here. Can I can I start get to the point where I actually right scolded here. you? <laughs> Please go. Oh, well, since story? he's paying though, I'm taking it. Great. You're gonna, <laughs> you're gonna promote bad things on this creature. Well, right? I am because this is funny. Okay, so I don't endorse any of it, by the way. Three o'clock. The three o'clock waking I up, or, you, the three o'clock and getting very little sleep, and then going out to the convention center went out the window, because um, we ended up we were gonna leave the behemoth party I think by eight, eight or nine. We were gonna leave pretty early so How we could go back work? and I could edit stuff and then get very little sleep and then wake up three o'clock in the morning. But that went out the window like I said. So um, uh, these guys ended up uh, ordering uh, multiple uh, alcoholic beverages. Um, as the night progressed, and it's not how it, went it got oh, it got it's to the point. James happened. just was like one after the other. Like the second it was done, oh, I'm gonna get another one. Um, but uh, I was controlled. Uh, you, you're <laughs> you're uh, getting behind me, like and going back and editing stuff that went out the window once you got drunk. It's like you guys wanted to stay longer. <laughs> Alex- to be honest, I don't think that was in the plans either way. <laughs> <laughs> what going back to the hotel? <laughs> yeah. What hap- yeah, what happened to the plan of meeting up with our, you know, manager and talking to that him about stuff? Too. You know, that well, was kind of a plan thing. At the party and- though, like it wasn't it wasn't like, you know, all like for nothing that we were just like <laughs> like cuz we fucking we met the people that are in charge of like Xbox Live Arcade and stuff, you know, on top of all the Behemoth people, like all the Xbox Live Arcade people were there too and we were talking to them for a bit. What did you do? Oh, my, my stomach's grumbling. Three you... orders of the same thing. <laughs> hey! Does anyone else want to pitch in? <laughs> do, you want, do you want the same no, thing? No, I'm good. I'm right. sure? That's going to be like I'll an $80 with order. I'll vegetable medley with beef. <laughs> I'll stick with that. <laughs> he got it. <laughs> you asshole. <laughs> I need three of the same right, thing. Right. <laughs> snapping at him? Oh, Are you about snapping it? at me for... Yes. Excuse me, like excuse to, me. Uh, <laughs> get, is there any beverages that can go with that? No, I'll, I'll steal one of his. Like? Never mind. A Coke? Yeah, what beverages are there? 
Uh, what's the special today, sir? Uh, yeah, so we have the house salad. I want to know what beverages with, there are. It comes with a dick, and it just goes in your mouth. Do it's you really do good. you do uh, Tao, or is it uh, Gao? Uh, oh, okay, so... I don't think they have that. Gao's on there. Guy Gao, Tao, brothers, confused, both cooks, chicken. But this is Tao's, that's oh, not yeah, yeah. Sal's, or Gao's. Oh, this is Tao's. This is Tao's, this is a completely different general. This Wasn't Tao the one guy from Dragon Ball? He was like one of the main early villains. General Tao. General Tao. <laughs> there, you go. there you go. Get his chicken. It's, it's a good. Dragon Ball theme. Either, either way. Restaurant. Either way. Can you please just leave and go order? Just go order. Why was food. I getting snapped at before I left I don't to go know. That was a hurry up. Are you kidding me right now? <laughs> and then, and this, then it this is the, this, dicking this is around. the perks of working with the creatures. <laughs> Welcome to the creatures, Alex. Snapped. Welcome to the creatures. Hurry up. Food. Hurry right. up, man. <laughs> Thanks, Alex. Thanks, Alex. Be sure to go outside and order. All right, anyway. Well, anyway, Ideal. so anyway, we didn't. You could like, yell really loud. Alex was actually backing me up because I was getting upset that we weren't leaving. Like I wasn't like we're not leaving, but I was at the same time I wanted to get work done for the hub, and uh, so I was like, you know, we gotta go around like eleven ish, and so three hours after you wanted to leave <laughs> in the first place. Well, three hours after we planned to leave, or two okay. hours after we planned to leave. All right, two or three. Um, and uh, I was like, okay, I guess meeting with Luke is out the window. And then it was just like, at least I can go back and edit some stuff. Yes. So Alex edit. is like, Alex is trying to talk James into leaving. <sighs> and the behemoth guys want to give a speech or whatever. And so it's like, okay, after the speech, we'll go. I feel it's very ignorant to leave before yeah, speech. Yeah, you don't want to like leave. No, right, then that's absolutely speech, fine. Okay, like, so speech. You gotta stay for that. And by the way, people have left at this point. People have yeah, left though. the party. They're, <laughs> they're um, part of the company, though. Huh? I feel like they're part of the company, though. Like, if I'm invited to the Hema's 10th anniversary, then I want to fucking stay and be like, because it's a fucking, it's like an honor to be invited there. I'm not a part of the company. I'm just a fucking YouTuber. So I'm going to stay, and I'm going to get drunk with them. And I'm going to talk to Xbox I would have done, done the same thing. You probably would have. I would have done the same thing. Wow. Got Continue. I feel I'm justified, though. All right. I think you are. All right, you felt bad the next day. No, I, I didn't feel bad enough to, I went with. So... Yeah, like, at, during the speech, there was a point where they called for a toast or whatever, and Alex and James were like, Oh, let's get our drinks! Let's get our drinks! That's exactly <laughs> how it went down. Let's get our, oh, we need a drink! We started doing Chip and Marshall. Yeah, no, that's exactly what they did. We did Chip and Marshall. We're like, after that, after that, Alex was now on board with, I'm drunk, I want to get more drunk. So he was trying to get as many drinks as he could. It got to the point where Alex was drinking other people's drinks that were just left on tables. <laughs> I don't think I've ever gotten to that he does, point. He gets to this point where it's like, oh, where it's like he, he gets to this point of like no return. Where it's yeah, like, I'm trying to cut. I'm trying to cut these guys off, but they just keep getting drinks. See, you don't get drunk. You See, if it drunk. was only one of them, you would have had an easier time. I had like two drinks. Both. I had two drinks. I had two. Jack and Cokes or whatever. The thing was, we bowled and stuff. Yeah, we did and, bowl. Uh, I, was, I, I was playing better with the more alcohol I had in me. I don't know why, so I wanted yeah, to it keep was bowling. Com- I was beating Alex and James, so it was just a competition between them two. Like, they were trying to beat each <laughs> other. Like, all right, Dan's way ahead. We just got to focus on each other. Yeah. yeah, he beat me when we were fine, and then I beat him when I was, like, fucking super, you know, alcoholed. But, but- so we get back to the hotel around 1.30ish or something like that. Damn. It's, it's pretty late. And I'm like, there's no way I'm going to be able to edit because I have to babysit these two now. Alex is huddled up in the bathroom, head between his knees. Feels like he's like, he's like, no, man, I don't know, man, I don't know. Like, you know, (laughs) James, it was funny when James still, everybody was pretty much fucking gone out of that bowling alley, that bowling alley bar thing. And James was like, hey, let's walk around San Diego. Let's walk around the city. (laughs) And Alex is just like. Oh man, we gotta we gotta go. We gotta go right now. <laughs> like he was about to lose his shit. Like he ended up going to the bathroom. All the he went up going to the bathroom in the bar and he was like, I, I almost threw up in there like later. But like so James <laughs> wants to fucking walk around San Diego. Alex is about to fucking lose his shit. But this is shit. nothing out of context for me. I still would have wanted to do that regardless. Yeah. Like yeah, probably. So like yeah, we ended up getting back. Alex is 
like, James is kind of fine. He was just like trying to go to sleep. I am kind of fine. Yeah. See so you. like he he wanted to go to sleep, and I'm like I'm just sitting here like I can't do shit because I need to take care of these two. I don't want to make sure. This must nobody, be the first nobody... Russian who can't hold his liquor <laughs> in the history. Why well, no, he drank? He drank a lot. Like he, like he was saying, he doesn't want to condone this. This is why he didn't want it brought up in the first place. But well, now he's not here, so too bad. Yeah, that's true. But he always does this. He gets it. He gets to the point where he puts himself in the situation, and then he like he's just like, man, I kind of regretted that. But, it's like, <laughs> but then the first opportunity, he's right back at it again. It's like, yeah. hold on. So Fuck. James ended up, James ended up kind of drifting off a little bit, but he started to get to the point where he's like, "Oh no, I don't know." Like he sits up on the bed and he's like, "I don't know, I might have to throw up or something." Uh-oh. The like, thing was, you had this, you had the soothing music. I had, playing. yeah, I had Pandora playing, <laughs> like he had, like, piano. some Yanni or playing. something. Yeah, yeah, and it was helping me. Like I was kind of feeling relaxed. And <laughs> it was feeling like, shit for Alex. The positive by the way. energy coming from Pandora. Alex didn't like it at all. Yeah. So while the music was playing, he's sitting in the bathroom. <laughs> Like, I do have video of all this. I have think video. Think how bad it would have been if you were at that <laughs> shitty hotel for that. Yeah. Oh yeah. That would have been true. much worse. But that was kind of. Yeah. yeah, yeah that would have been bad. That been terrible. But so like yeah, James is like, I don't know. I, I might have to like like he he felt bad, but not bad enough to throw up immediately. So he was like, I might have to make myself throw up. And so he got he like vacated Alex out of the bathroom and went like, in and, the fuck out and did here. his I was business. Like, I'm, getting, I'm done with this. I'm getting rid of it. And it was like the the sounds of James throwing up was like oh, no. making Alex kind of queasy. And I put the music. I was like, is that helping? He's like, no, that's not helping. <laughs> like, uh, that's not helping at all. <laughs> so James after that was like peachy keen. He was still drunk, but he wasn't like he wasn't feeling sick yeah. anymore. Yeah, so he laid featured. down. <laughs> Alex was like, was like, because he he wanted to do the panels were the next day. So I was like, I don't want to feel like this throughout the entire night. And then into tomorrow because yeah. the alcohol is still in my system. I was thinking at this point neither of them were going to make it to the panels because I was just like, there, there's no way they're going to make so it to the panels. Like, they're going to be it. so hungover. I'm just going to get rid of it. Yeah. Blah. Blah. Hey, I'm good. <laughs> so like, I felt kind of bad. Like I didn't want to go to sleep when they were like when when Alex was still like really sick. But at the same time, I had to go to sleep because I was so tired. It was like yeah, three o'clock in the morning by the time I ended up going to sleep. Um, but Alex, Alex went to sleep in the bathtub. Oh, and, what? Because he was afraid he was gonna like. He came uh, out. He's just like, "Give me a blanket. I'm gonna sleep in here." Yeah, yeah. So he goes to sleep in the bathtub. He ended up like moving into, I guess, a bed or the floor or something like. That. You know, you move to the floor because. The, the tub has this weird thing where the faucet will, like, randomly leak water every once in a oh, while. Right. So he ended up getting, like, dribbled on. <laughs> <laughs> so he ended up coming out. But Series yeah. of unfortunate events. Yeah, next Man. morning, um, I, I woke those guys up. Like, I took a shower and then woke them up. And uh, it got to the point where we had to leave in order to make meeting that kid at, I think it was maybe 8.30, not 9.30. Um, because the, the, the hall, they, they let the people in the hall at 9, and then the panel starts at 10. That's what it was. Um, so 8.30 in the morning, uh, I ended up waking up at like 7.30 or something like that. Took a shower, woke them up, said, well, woke James up, pretty much said, we need to go pretty much now in order to make it in time. <laughs> and James Alex, okay. He's like, okay, Alex yeah. is just like, oh, I, I'm not going to be able to make it do. Like, I'll, I'll stay back. And he was like, if I'm feeling better later, I'll, I'll go to the floor and like film shit or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> and so James ended up coming with me. But James was like, he was. You were still out of it. You still. Yeah, didn't I was feel fucking. Right. I was like in the in the morning. I was just like, oh god, like it. Like I was just like, I don't even know what kind of state I was in in the morning. Really but weird. I, state. I was just kind of like I, I said. I was in like autopilot. I was just kind of like I was just drug along pretty much. Like I was just. Doing <laughs> Come on, whatever. James, let's go. Come I was on. Just like whatever, whatever, whatever. Yeah. And we got to the panels, and then it was the world's end at the top of the panel. So yeah. I was. I, I we got in. By the way, that. we we got in. The kid, the, the, uh, the kid, yeah. We sat down. Uh, we, <laughs> we sat, sat down. down. No. Well, we walked up to, like, the entrance to Hall H, which was through the inside of the convention center. And there's, like, this roped-off area because you can't just go straight in. And um, he's waiting for, I guess, his mom or his mom's friend. I think it was his mom's friend or something like that who worked at the convention center who knew yeah. him to let us in. He said his mom was in a meeting or something. Yeah. And I guess she's in charge of Hall H or something like that. Oh, dang. But, right. um... So I guess a couple of his friends who were also volunteers like him walked over and like, like they, they had already gotten in and they were going to go, I guess, sit into a couple of the panels. And um, they walked over and were talking to him and they're like, hey, he's like, hey, have you seen blah, blah, blah? And they're like, no, no, like, you know, she's doing something. And he's like, OK, so like we were waiting for her and he was texting her. And this security guy comes over. So like, hey, what are you guys what are you guys doing to the volunteer kids who are on the other side of the line? 
And he was like, oh, uh, yeah, they, they let us in, and they were gonna, we were going to go in and uh, just see a little bit of the, like, the Hall H and stuff like that. They, they let us in, and they said it was fine. He was like, uh, like he was being, he had like a stick up his ass. He was just like, he was like, if you think you're going to get your friends in here, that's not how this works and stuff like that. He was like, you know, that's it's not going to happen. And so, so it didn't happen then? It didn't. Well, no, 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 no. So it happened. I would, he, it ended happen booting, he ended up booting those two volunteers to the other, like, to the side we were on. Like, he ended up kicking them out. He's like, yeah, was you know, like we're gonna, off. he was like, we're, no, I'm sorry, we're going to need this area cleared. Uh, you're not getting in. And stuff like that. And All he was right. just being a dick to them. And what a great guy. so we're standing there like, shit, are we not going to get in because uh-huh. of, you know, Captain Security Guard right here? <laughs> like, James was saying he's one of these guys who walks around with his hand constantly on his walkie-talkie adjusting volume. <laughs> and he totally was. Like, he was just walking around like, all right, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Go blue. Go blue. Go Go blue. Like Go blue. Go blue. We got two guys standing in Hall H. We need, yeah. we need backup stat. So we're standing there waiting for the person. And the the people who camped outside were starting to walk in like they were starting to flood into the hall and we're like oh shit we're not gonna get like good seats which to be honest the fact that we were getting it at all was pretty good I, I'm not gonna be like oh we didn't get considering we waited in line like six yeah. hours last Th- I mean year those people fucking in. deserve to be there and I was gonna be one of those people but those people were in. in line well before even like the plan time that Dan wanted to oh go. I'm sure they were. oh yeah they yeah. were there there were pe- when we ended up leaving Hall H there were people already setting up camp. The, for the next day, leaving Hall H. Holy crap! Yeah. So, um, but yeah, we, we the lady ended up coming through and getting us in, and we were uh, we got about halfway into the room. Was it in front it, of the security? It was guard. right in front of us. Yeah, you should be like, no, you said it, this didn't happen. Yeah, and then walked right front of the security. That, guard, no, there was a shit ton of people walking through, and the lady ended up coming through and letting us in. Um, and we thanked her and stuff like that. I saw her the last day actually. I did. Uh, I was waiting in line at Starbucks though, so I couldn't. I go. couldn't get to her, but. You should be like, oh, do you want to get in line in front of me? I can help you here. <laughs> yeah. Return the favor, yeah. But, uh, yeah, so she, she ended up getting us in. And the, 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 uh, the kid, um, Max was his name. His name was Max. Uh, I forgot his name for a second. He ended up sitting with us, like, all day, like, just watching the panels and stuff like that. It was really cool. I kept offering him food because I kept going out to get food. I was like, are you sure you don't want food? <laughs> Because uh, I was just like bearded out by that, you know. Well, Well, he 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 came in with a water bottle. Yeah, he came in with a water bottle and a banana, and I'm just like, and he ate that pretty quick throughout the like in the morning, and I'm like, are you sure you don't want food? We will get you food. You got us in the hall H. We will get you food, and he was just like, oh, I'm fine, like every single (laughs) time. So yeah, it started off with uh, the World's End with uh, Edgar Wright, Simon Pegg, and Nick Frost, moderated by was that Chris Hardwick? No, that wasn't Chris Hardwick. It was somebody else. No, it was Chris Hardwick. It was Chris Hardwick. Chris, <laughs> Chris Hardwick. Um, uh, Chris Hardwick oh, uh, moderated it. He was pretty good. Oh, I thought it hurt Alex. Um, that was really that was a really funny panel. That was it was awesome seeing them together in real life. What were your thoughts, James? It was good. All right, so the next panel after that. He's probably arguing. I don't want to run down now. every single panel. That's going to take a while. How many how many seats were in Hall H? Do you think? Uh, a couple thousand at least. Yeah, I don't know. It was a lot. A few thousand. It was All a right. lot. How'd it go, Chief? Went, went dashingly well. Took a while. Dash away, dash away, dash away. Language barrier issues there like were. James usually has. <laughs> There's a little bit of those. There's a little bit of delivery time issues and whatnot. But are you done? Am I, am I not... Am I safe now to return here? Or is yeah, you've already been. You've already. I've already been bashed on and everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah that was a lot of shit about you. Really? Yeah. I wasn't there, yeah. so I couldn't. Yeah. You couldn't. I'm saying that I hate. I just me? hate everything about you. Well, I, don't know, I couldn't defend you. I mean, did you defend me at RTX? Yes. Ooh. Did you? Did he? No, I didn't. He, he didn't. left you. Yeah, yeah you he left, left me. You. I, I wasn't there to leave you. So. Yeah, like really. I was. I wasn't. You want me to defend your honor when you don't defend mine previously? I was not in a position to defend your honor. You were in a position. You were in a good. You were in a better position than I was. I was lost. He was lost in the middle of downtown Austin. Anyway, it's crazy. <laughs> anyway, day three. So no, no, we're stopping. <laughs> well, yeah, like throughout the day, James doesn't want to go down on the panels. We saw Vin Diesel. James checked that off his <gasps> list of people he wanted to see. Vin Diesel. Throughout the entire day of panels. Dan yeah, kept saying, he kept looking over to me and he was like, hey, you can cross this person off your <laughs> list of like people you want to see, like people like Vin Diesel and shit. And I was just like, Simon Pegg. What the fuck? Yeah, Simon Pegg. Okay, but Vin fucking Diesel? What? Like, when has he been Vin on my fucking Diesel. bucket list to meet or see? <laughs> I don't even fucking... Re- Chris Hardwick. I don't know. <laughs> he was already checked off your list. Yeah, Chris um, Hardwick already, yeah. But, uh, yeah, so we saw like panels for Kick-Ass too and Riddick. 
Um, caught it with a chance of meatballs too, which they were fucking. Their presentation was getting fucked up by the the, the video people. A lot of the later ones. Were yeah, the video was getting fucked up a lot. Um, uh, what else? Did Spider we Man. See? Spider Man. Well, the Amazing <laughs> Spider. No, I, I was leading up to that. The Amazing Spider Man was the biggest movie they showed there. And it was like, Game of Thrones, which I cut out. Game of for. Thrones. Okay, yes, Game of Thrones. James was like Walking originally. Dead. Walking, that's, Walking that's Dead. That's what I was trying to think of. <laughs> he forgot Walking Dead. I was Dead. trying to think of it, but then you said Spider-Man. And I'm like, I know that one. But, well, yeah, the Game of Thrones one was, like, I think right before Spider-Man or something like that. Kind of towards the end-ish. And James was like, well, you know, I don't want to get spoiled for that, so I might just cut out wasn't and go to the Wasn't that other book, that shitty movie after Game the of Thrones? The City of Bones. Yeah, wasn't that or after? Whatever. That was like, I that was like a mo- oh that was RoboCop and yeah okay so that was RoboCop, RoboCop. and City of Bones and it was a couple different movies yeah, together because I, I came back after after Game of Thrones ended and that was going yeah. on and they, they showed that clip of that movie and I was just like what the fuck is this yeah but uh, I guess that was I think that was Sony's presentation or something like that yeah but um, Game of Thrones Game of Thrones uh, James didn't want to get spoiled for it and he nope. was talking about just cutting out and like from the panels and going to the floor or whatever and I was like. You're gonna leave me in here like for the rest of the day by myself. What about Spider Man? What about Spider Man? Oh my God! Luckily, for someone that was, uh, would have been fine being there by himself, I was there <laughs> for half the day, over half the day, he wasn't fine with the last panel. I had to for that, uh, I don't know. I guess. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. I wanted to share the experience. Plus, we were gonna be doing impressions videos on it anyway, but we didn't end up. Which you didn't anyways. end up doing. <laughs> I got to see Django, which I crossed that off my list yes. too. Yeah. <laughs> Jamie Foxx is off the list. Michael Keaton's off my list. Um, Jeff for, Bridges for, for is Michael Robocop. Keaton. This is the weirdest thing, and I said this to him. <laughs> you when did we were say there. this. This is so fucking stupid. It's like it's the Call of Duty thing all over again. Oh, People no. shit on Michael Keaton. They hate his Batman. They hate his Batman. <laughs> he comes out on stage and gets like a standing ovation. People, Batman, Batman. It's like. <laughs> What the fuck? People don't like his movie. Why are you saying he's Batman now? What? That doesn't make any sense. He actually got a couple Batman questions. Yeah, I was like, what? Um, <laughs> what the fuck? It's it doesn't random. make any sense. Yeah. They shit on his Batman. <laughs> but yeah, it's amazing there at Comic-Con. Maybe it's just, just those he's a celebrity. people. He's a celebrity in front of them. They have to cheer. All him. I know is after they I seen, uh, after I watched White Noise, Michael Keaton was <laughs> no longer anywhere near my list. <laughs> hey, I still like. Hold on, I liked that movie up till the that shitty ending. Like that ending was so bad. No, that ending was terrible. <laughs> that ending was terrible. That movie had me until the ending. Um, but anyway, Fuck yeah, that. Michael Keaton. Um, but yeah, James ended up like getting a pass to leave the hall, and he, he got a he, yeah. Like, I forgot pass that they return. do those passes where if you cut out or whatever, they give you like a for one panel. or an hour time limit. Like yeah. they give you the the time of one panel to get back. So I pretty much had like an hour that I could leave during the entire Game of Thrones and yeah. come back as long as it was before that yeah. time. James didn't want to get spoiled. I didn't want to get spoiled either, but I also didn't want to leave the hall. Um, so like I ended up staying throughout it. <laughs> the very because James and I have not watched any of Game of Thrones. We both have the seasons that are available on like DVD and Blu-ray or whatever, and we just haven't watched them yet. And the, the panel starts off with a montage of every single death in the show, every single well, character. I guess death, that would spoil major it. Major characters, minor characters. Like it has the character's name, and then they die. Like they had like. You know, Yarl someone, 1, Yarl 2, asked, and stuff like that. Someone asked a question if they could do a prequel so that way Sean Bean doesn't die in something. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a prequel series following his guy. Poor um, Sean Bean. Yeah. <laughs> Poor Sean Bean. Uh, yeah, it was was he, even, he wasn't on that panel, was he? he no, wasn't, no, no, no. That would have been there. awesome if he was there. Yeah, that would have been cool. That been, I, uh, I would have checked that off, off my list. list. Yeah, yeah, check off my list. But um, it was a pretty cool panel. I didn't know a thing they were fucking talking about. They kept talking about Red Wedding, like, towards the middle-ish of the panel. I guess that was a big event that happened in the thing. Um, but they showed, like, a, a deleted scene from one of the seasons, and it seemed kind of interesting. They said it never fit in anywhere, so they never put it in there. But it was, like, not action at all. It was just, like... Put it on the fucking DVD, then. I what don't the know. Hell? probably is. I would hope so. <laughs> that scene? I don't... I don't know why they show. That's the only thing they showed. I don't know why they would show um, that at Comic Con if whatever. it's already on the DVD. Special whatever. deleted scene for all of you Game of Thrones fans. Yeah. Walking Dead was also. <laughs> Walking Dead was there. That was pretty cool to see Rick and uh, <laughs> again, again. Because we um, did see them last year. Did we see them last year? We yeah. saw Breaking Bad. We what saw we saw Lori. We didn't see Rick in there. Oh yeah, it was just Lori. We saw the yeah the women who kick ass panel. When we were waiting to go see the Breaking Bad one, they had the women who kick ass panel before that, and it had Lori on it. Lori. Lori. But it, no, it didn't have uh, it <laughs> Lori. Didn't have any of them. 
So this had like the oh, major man. like principal cast except for Carl. <laughs> like everyone was there, <laughs> but Carl. but Chandler Riggs. They never sent him to Comic Con, didn't he say that? They last didn't year? send him last year. Yeah, yeah he, he was said talking that they don't about send him to Comic Con. He they was sent going him to other Comic Con. Like they the they sent him to ones. New York Comic Con, but yeah. we never ended up going to that. Um, but uh, yeah, so that was really cool. They ended up, I guess, revealing the trailer that they had for the new season exclusively before it went live everywhere else. Tyrese was there. Tyrese AKA was there. Coach, I Get checked him goop. off my coach. list. He was checked check off your coach. list. I got to meet the guy. I met the Coach. Pills here. Uh, what's his name? <laughs> Some um, good old fashioned. Norman Paula. Reedus, check him off your list. Norman Reedus, I got his phone number. You did get Norman Reedus' phone number. Oh, man. <laughs> Norman Reedus. Oh, Norman man. Reedus. But, uh, yeah, Walking Dead was really good. Um, yeah, it was all pretty good. The Amazing Spider-Man was pretty cool because uh, Andrew Garfield came out in the Spider-Man outfit. And uh, did his little dance and talked for a little bit. He called Jamie Django. Yeah. He's like, oh man, I get to meet Django. And then. It turns out it's funny because I guess uh, Hugh Jackman and Andrew Garfield both said they want to be in the Avengers. Both of them have said they want to be in the Avengers. On the panel? Well, he said it on the panel. Yeah, Andrew Garfield said it on the panel. And then Hugh Jackman had said, like, I guess at one point he said that he wishes there wasn't, like, all the shit with all the companies and stuff because he wants to be in it as well. Yeah. It's like, put them in the fucking movie. I hate Fox. Settle your shit. I hate Fox. And put them in the movie. Fox is kind of poopy. Okay, petition started for Fox. (laughs) They don't want to lose the money. I don't see why they don't just settle on something where they get a cut or something like that. Just like, we'll give you Wolverine. Why get a cut when you you can get all of it? Because they're never going to make something that good that is going to top the Avengers. <laughs> that's, that's what they're, they're going to try to Neither do. Neither is but Sony then, with then, fucking then, Spider-Man. That's what Days of Futures Past is. That is their it's Avengers. That's their what Avengers, they're trying yeah. to do. But the fact that they're, they're taking characters from, like, poop movies, essentially, and bringing them into a big movie that they're saying is like, Oh, we got all the best of the best, but who the fuck liked Last Stand? What the fuck? Okay, that's why it didn't even I, make any sense that like they were they, the, the whole Wolverine premise. Let's focus on the Wolverine for the only you know one off movie. The Wolverine and was like a branch a bunch from of Avengers. Last Stand or whatever, but it's like again they should realize that Last Stand was probably by far the worst one out of the bunch, and by far probably the worst rated. <laughs> it's down there probably. How are the Ghost Riders doing? Are they just like, hey, <laughs> they're pro- it's probably down Ghost there. With them. I can't Avengers. believe there's been two of those movies. It's probably down there with them somewhere down the line. I don't. We were know, supposed to do a Ghost Rider movie night. We Ghost Rider. I just don't see <laughs> like, that. Is not, that's, it's not on. The, it's not. I think on everyone the same does. Level. What about Nicolas Cage? What if he wants to be in the Avengers? He probably does. <laughs> I'm the Ghost Rider. He I'm wants to do Rider. Expendables first, and then he'll oh, go to the Avengers. Man. <laughs> I'm pretty Aww. sure, I mean, but, I mean, what the fuck? Like, that would be, it'd be awesome to have both of them in there because, I mean, they Huge play the, they play the parts really well. They're just, like, they're stuck around, they like, just get circumstantial shit that, like, leads to <laughs> poopy fights. Like, I don't think you're going to find a better Wolverine than Hugh Jackman. Oh, no, and he's going to end up dying before they decide. Oh, I mean, okay, he's out the door. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying, he's how long it's going to take this whole, like, contractual stuff to go through? Uh, there's going to be some other Avenger and... It's gonna be some of the Justin Wolverine. Justin Bieber is gonna end up growing the. Well, chops he can't. He and... can't be Wolverine forever, too. He's gonna get old eventually. Yep. He's gonna be. Same doing with Ron Perlman if they don't get on <laughs> Hellboy. That's all makeup, though. So They're not gonna put Wolverine Perlman. on Hugh Jack or Wolverine. They're not They'll gonna put makeup on Hugh Jack. Completely Jackson. like CGI. And then like they like, did yeah. with Patrick Stewart. Yeah. They, they did, Have you ever seen those like everything wrong with uh, like uh, videos like everything wrong with. Uh, X Men: The Last Stand in, in under you, six you, minutes or whatever. You show me the the room or is that the movie the room? Sins they did one? the room. No, yeah, it's movie sins. Yeah, yeah. They they did the thing where it, like, it was a sin. Like at the very beginning, they're like you know CGI uh, made they they CGI Patrick Stewart to make him look younger when he looks exactly as he did like twenty years ago and stuff like that. And they showed a picture from like Next Generation Star Trek and he <laughs> looks, looks exactly the same. Yeah, I mean, he, he doesn't, doesn't he, age he ages pretty yeah. well for the most part. I mean, he's looking a little older now, but like not during yeah. last. Day. And so I know, I just ma- I'd rather have all of the all of the products back under the Marvel umbrella. Like yeah. they they're on a roll right now. Except and uh, they, like Ghost Rider. Ghost 
they could probably do Ghost Rider Blade. well if they wanted to. Blade with the Avengers. Blade's already Blade. back. Fucking Blade with the Avengers. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Wesley's nice. What's this vampire doing here? <laughs> Wesley Snipes? Oh, he just got out of jail. <laughs> he's paying his taxes <laughs> off. Oh god. That's what he's doing. That wouldn't he, he's, he should be out of jail now. It's, uh, it's past July. He should be out of prison now. Yeah, okay. How long did he Wesley get? I need to Google that. How long did he go? Oh, what, did he get like 10 years? How long has I he think he got out the 28th or something like that. Uh, 28th. He got, he got a good bit of time. I, I hear taxes, got... everyone. <laughs> yeah, really. I, was, I watched a Howard Stern interview with him, and he was talking about, like, it was right before that shit, and Howard was asking him questions about taxes or whatever. He's like, hey, man, it's not me that's going to jail. It's the fucking accountant. <laughs> that was me. I didn't know about that and stuff like that. And I was Game like, over, yeah. I was like, no, knowing now what I know, I'm like, no, you're going to jail. <laughs> well, yeah, you knew about it apparently. Uh, uh, poor Wesley Snipes. Poor please. Wesley Snipes. <laughs> anyway, but they, they also announced uh, at Comic Con. They also announced the Batman Superman movie. Oh yeah, I remember seeing. That. Oh, Chris, I, I watched the actual reveal. Somebody posted the um, uh, like video of that. Um, Because they had the actor, um, like the general guy from Man of Steel come out and read, I guess, a quote from like a Batman Superman uh, comic book thing. And then they just like, he had, he read the quote and then like the lights went down and then they revealed the Batman Superman logo. And then everybody fucking goes nuts. And then Chris Hardwick comes on, the lights come back up and he's like, what the fuck was that? What the fuck was that? (laughs) He's like, I didn't know they were going to. And he was like, well, thank you for coming out to Hall H. And, like, because it was the last thing of the day, I guess. <laughs> yeah. And so he was just, like, freaking out. But, yeah, I, I don't know. I'm excited for that. Although General there's, Zod here. There's a, there's a lot of people who have, like, reservations, and I understand that. But I'm still excited for it. And I, don't, I don't think it. I mean, I don't know. I don't think it'll. I was thinking the other day who I would spooky. want to be Batman. Who I would want to be Batman. And I thought Army yeah. Hammer for a little Nicholas bit. Nicolas Cage. I was thinking <laughs> Nicholas Cage. Nicholas Cage. Well, he was up to be. It's got to be Joseph Gordon Levitt. When Tim Burton oh, was yeah, going to yeah. do uh, Superman back before they did like Superman Returns and all that shit, like in the '90s, they were going to do a Superman movie, and uh, Tim Burton's Superman was going to be Nicholas Cage. Like they had pictures of him with fucking long hair, oh, and, like a mustache. Damn, and, like, what the? In a Superman, it looks disgusting. I should pull up those pictures. <laughs> <laughs> but like, there's uh, the Wesley Snipes thing. <laughs> oh, yeah. But like, um, but you'd think it would be Joseph Gordon-Levitt, but Marvel supposedly picked him up too. Oh, so yeah, he might what? be Doctor Strange. Is Everything's, Doctor getting, Strange. Everything's getting all mucked up. Oh, man. They're picking Can't repeat keep... actors. Ew! 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 That was his. That was his costume test. <laughs> oh my! <laughs> Could you God. imagine? Look at how like squish the S looks. <gasps> that looks like shit. That's pretty bad. <laughs> Holy crap! <laughs> That's so bad. Um, <laughs> oh man! Nicholas Cage. Thanks for joining us for Cruise. What could have been? Oh, what man. could have been? <sighs> Good thing that didn't happen. Anyway, <laughs> I'm gonna leave that up there for now. Um, we done with day two yet? Holy shit! But I think it, uh, who was it? It was it was it was the dude that uh, the the Henry dude that plays Superman or whatever. Henry because he had Cabell. he had Cabell? gotten a, he had gotten a question about a Justice League movie and that was like the big thing, and he had said. And he, he, this is pretty much the exact same shit as the Avengers, but he had said, you know, every character from the Justice League needs to have an introduction. They all need to be built up to a certain point. They all need proper build up and then come together for one final push. Or whatever. But now it's just like, okay, we already established Batman. Superman's out. Let's quick put them together. It's like, you know, we got to we gotta quick knock the Avengers out of here or something like that. Like, they're not Good giving luck. it time to build up into a big justice yeah, how long was it I'm that? actually I'm I'm glad that they're actually putting more than one superhero in the movie like you know Iron Man's its own movie but like it doesn't make sense that there are no other fucking superheroes in that movie yeah, but it's, like it's when there's a national centered, thing happening you don't want the focus to like go off of, that's the whole thing with like the justice league or whatever if they introduce them all at once they wouldn't be able to properly tell each one of their stories. They're, none of them would get a proper focus, yeah. so all of their characters would fall what, what, flat. What but I mean, that's why they need their own individual movies, so that way they have like a build-up, a build-up, a build-up. So Batman up. needs his own movie? Is that what you're saying? No, I'm or? saying Batman already had it. Batman was yeah. already established. Then why can't Superman, you take... Superman. They took, they took Superman that had one movie that And just they just established out, that. And they so put now they them have two, two together. Yeah. But the whole idea is people wanted Justice League. People didn't want Superman, Batman. They went Justice League. The whole thing whole shebang. The whole shebang. All I want to say is that uh, Daniel Baxter, for for his he, 
on at the end of his Superman. Did you even watch that yet? Yeah. Oh, okay. The man he has uh, he has the Aquaman in that. Yeah, oh, Aquaman at the end. <laughs> it was it was when uh, that shot where like he's, like in Superman's the in the water and he's like beard and he's yeah. just sitting there floating. Aquaman just comes up and he's like, hey. Hey, when are we? When what are you doing, doing? Justice League? Kind of thing. And, like, and he's like, Justice. Like I was gonna yeah, say, just, there, uh, <laughs> that that new, the like I said before, the uh, the the um, what the fuck is it called? Like Flashpoint uh, Paradox oh, or something. I just like bought that. that yesterday. I'm gonna watch uh, that. The Flash, the it's it's Flash centered. It's the Flash's like animated movie, but it's really really well done. Kevin, but Tom- at its core, it's still pretty much a flat. It's it's like Flash's storyline. Yeah. Like nobody else really gets a proper build up or anything. It's like just Flash. That. It's mostly Flash. I'd say Batman is kind of secondary, but it's not. Is that Kevin Conroy as Batman? I think I saw it on the. Kevin thing. Conroy is in the beginning as normal Batman, but then it okay. becomes his dad. Okay, because it so it's not. It said featuring Kevin Conroy on yeah, the back, and yeah. I'm like, who does Batman's? They're they're in all this? they're they're all at the beginning for okay. a short amount of time, cool. but then like. I don't mind switching. It goes it up, through like, time travel yeah. and stuff, and then okay. it's all different people. I but can't at, wait you to know, watch at, that. at the center of it all, it is the Flash. Yeah. Like it's like a Flash built movie. So it's like that's what I mean. Like it's it's they that's how it would kind of be. But still, one character yeah, would still have to start be... throwing in like Hawkeye's build up was pretty much just. Well, Hawkeye's supposed to have Thor. a he's supposed to have a bigger one in Avengers. Oh yeah, Joss Whedon was saying he said he's back on for that. Joss Whedon was saying his uh, his favorite part of writing the Avengers sequel. Has been writing Hawkeye because Hawkeye spent you know the majority of the first movie you know zombie Take Hawkeye, <laughs> so like he was saying Spoilers. it's been it's been the most fun fleshing out that character. He said writing because like yeah. you know, not writing everything. like even with the Avengers you had a, you like like Hawkeye you had a Here's few characters a that twist. weren't fleshed out. Here's a plot twist: Hawkeye's buildup was actually the Born Legacy. Oh. <laughs> That's how he got superior. So when he turned, at like, he uses the pills and gets. So when he turned derpy, vision. right? When yeah. he turned derpy, that was like <laughs> he gets ultimate vision when the. the I shoot arrows away. now. <laughs> okay. Oh man, oh. The movie was miserable. You know, I, I, I bet Joss Whedon's favorite part about writing Hawkeye in the next one is that he dies in the first ten minutes. What would happen? <laughs> what would happen if he Hawkeye died? Again. No, what if he, what if he what if he died in the first ten minutes of Avengers? Age of I don't Ultron. know. After, after seeing Hawkeye in the first one, now I'm more so excited for Ant Man to be in one of these. I want yeah. Ant Man, like, but I at the same time I want Edgar Wright to do it justice too. Yeah. But like, I would rather have Ant Man in there. Yeah. Well, that's Phase to. Three. It seems Phase Three isn't going to be a lot of like necessarily you know the same superheroes we do before. I don't know if they're going to do another Iron Man movie between I two and not. three. Again, I don't think I don't like that. Like Iron Man, I don't think is necessary anymore he's already built up you can throw yeah, him well, in whatever well, he's well that's the thing he knows. is, is he's, money he's only signed on for avengers 2 and 3 he's not signed on for anything else so. but that's all he needs to be in i know that's, that's what i'm saying is like they're probably not going to do an iron man so that's they're what i mean like the, with, the, with the justice league stuff now, now they can focus on building other single people pretty much like ant-man or dr strange or whatever the fuck else they want to yep. like build up yep 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 Guardians of the Galaxy. But it'll make it that much better when they introduce them by themselves and then they get put into the Avengers. It's just going to be like, yeah. I don't know. I'd, if they can topple the Avengers, like if he can topple his own shit, that'd be fucking crazy. Together to the topple. So that was the panels and stuff. Um, we didn't end up, get, we wanted to go in Friday or Saturday to go see the Marvel stuff, but we did not get in, unfortunately. Um, uh, so Friday or Saturday, we ended up doing um, cosplay all day as Bat Dan's and Robins, Robin number one and Robin number two, and we did that video. That's on the hub, obviously. If you haven't seen it, check it out. It's on the hub. Bat Dan's and Robins. That was fun walking around all day in a Batman Where the costume. Fuck you think you're going? That was quite. All right. How did, you like, uh, how did you like? How did you like being in the Robin suit all day, Alex? All right. Good answer. What did you think about taping your dick down? <laughs> All right. Good answer. So what did you think about that artist who, uh, like, after going up to a couple different artists and asking them um, to not draw a picture of you, uh, what did you think of that? Pretty good answer. All right. So Go back to the dick part. The dick part. <laughs> so Alex came out in his Robin outfit, and it's like... <laughs> <laughs> And you can clearly see his dick in it. And, um... <laughs> what, do you think this wasn't going to get brought up? <laughs> he doesn't... He didn't want it to be brought up. <laughs> Dude, 
I end up breaking something. Oh no! <laughs> really happening right now. <laughs> Poor Alex. So ridiculous. I go through so much punishment <laughs> and torture. You brought this upon yourself. Okay. I'm going to tell the story. Okay. <laughs> All right. Basically, for the, the bat dance, the bat dance thing was something we were going to do. We had the suits. James got a suit. I got a suit. We brought it with us. I had only tried mine kind of on. But then when it came time for the actual Show event, time. Uh, I put it on and I realized that despite wearing boxers, uh, my dick was completely visible. <laughs> just it right was like through it. It was like flopping like, around and stuff. No, like, there was no like if I went somewhere, people would notice. Like there was no <laughs> hiding it. It was so tight you could like define it even. So I was like, no. "This is really yeah, bad." Yeah, I seen it. I seen. I seen it. <laughs> I seen it. I seen it. I seen it. I came out of the bathroom. Dick. I'm like, "How bad is it?" And they're both like, "What the fuck?" <laughs> so I'm like, "Well, this is great." It's like, so what are you? I started making a big scene. I'm like, "I don't want to fucking do this, Dan." Like, people are gonna see my dick and all this shit. I'm like, "I don't want fucking Tumblr gifts of my dick all over the internet." Yeah. I was just like, "I was like, what's wrong with that?" Yeah, that? It only no. adds to the video. <laughs> that's like, why. Well, so if you watch that video now, that's why I zoom in on his dick a lot, like his crotch. <laughs> We did it a couple times. We did, like we did it once. Where this is what this is what I work with now. This. I no, I did it because I knew it'd be funny to us to watch it. Back. <laughs> to only us. Did you watch it? Yeah, I watched it. <laughs> was yeah. it funny? No, it wasn't funny. <laughs> I knew he was doing it too because he'd be like holding the camera at my face and just like pointing down <laughs> and up again. I'm like, really? like okay. It's... But uh, I I made a big deal and I didn't want to do it and I was like, you know, I'm just I don't even want to fucking wear the suit. But Dan gave me this whole spiel about like. Man, this is one of the fucking this things whole, we have planned. This whole thing is ruined now. Like, I well, I think whole, I gave I gave you guilt about this whole skit is ruined. <laughs> we had two Robins. We we're gonna do tons of stuff. Now just we had a ruined. concept pre-planned, and then also I think I was giving you shit about like not coming for Friday, and like for the oh, panels yeah, yeah, and yeah, stuff like that. Obviously that. that. Well, wow, you're just getting all even, over the place. Even though whatever, but um, so my idea was that. In order for things to happen, I had to somehow hide my package. Yeah. So Dan got me this. You, fucking, you, you had to tape that package up. This and this send it off. Super duct tape. Like it was the Justin Bieber duct tape. This, <laughs> all right. This. Yeah, which is on the robot over there. Good. Yeah, this Justin Bieber duct tape. So I had to like. You had well, Justin Bieber on your dick. Yeah, I had to put <laughs> Justin Bieber and like tighten things down and like move things appropriately. Oh, no. So that way, when the 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 super tight outfit comes on. Nothing was revealed, and I think for the most part that worked out very it, well. It did work out really. How well, how well did it work out for you in the end, though? Well, like, listen, because this was like right. eight hours of this, walking around a show floor, this getting sweaty was the and hot. Worst thing that I have done to my package, <laughs> <laughs> and I've done a lot of bad things to my package. Yeah. It's all right. S spare you the information. It's the okay. sound. Just, the sound of him taking it off in the bathroom. I wish I could. I. I went, had. I went to grab the hub I camera like real quick and I got this. Yeah. That I had to rip off. Yeah. yeah that I, was good. You would hear you would hear like Oh what the fuck? <laughs> You're like, I, God damn it! <laughs> <laughs> ah, ah. I, I, I still have scars on my oh, groin. No. Like because I ripped out and there was like bleeding and stuff. Yeah. Oh, like, it was yeah. Yeah. The, thing, the thing was, I after he did that and he came out, he's like, oh. I was like, Were you bleeding? And he was like, No, I wasn't bleeding. Yeah. Yeah. Later on he was like, oh, I was bleeding. Wow, <laughs> the story changed. Some story padding going on right now. I didn't think I was. How much bleeding. blood? It wasn't it wasn't that much? But it was enough to like leave a little like, trinket uh, of blood. It was Jesus. enough to uh, some dick blood. Enough to leave like scars and stuff, like <laughs> scabs on. Oh like, no! Yeah. yeah, no, I'm. I'm I, hey, and dick? it's not like it's not like I don't appreciate what you did. Yeah, this appreciate was all. What you did, your dick. Everyone go that, watch the video, video again, just to make. Yeah, it everybody go watch that sacrifice. video and and talk about it in the comments. Alex's and, you know, sacrifice. Talk about it in the comments. Alex's sacrifice hashtag. <laughs> hashtag um, Alex's sacrifice. The ultimate sacrifice. No, walking on the show floor really sucked and all that. Yeah. But, uh, but the video happened. Yeah, though, the right video. The, the video, video came out like ran. half an hour long, so great. there was plenty of usable stuff in there, and great it was really video good. From that, I'm not uh, like I appreciate what you did there. Yeah, there no, a, I'm glad you took one for the team. Yeah, man. Alex learned about taking one for the team. That's I really appreciate. I learned it. about. I think he's, most of us have taken one. I think for he's the done the ultimate take it for the other. team, though. Like, I mean, he put hard. tape around his dick. Yes. If anything, you should have put more tape around the dick to elongate it and make it like crazy obscenely long, and you should have walked around like that. 
Yeah, that would have been really good, I think. <laughs> I think it went over well. Yeah? Well, maybe I'll do that next time. Maybe, yeah. I'll think maybe next it. time that'll get us free pretzel dogs. <laughs> <laughs> Those things were good. He went oh, up man. He went up and walked up and asked. I was like, you know, just tell him bat dance it. Yeah, it'll be he's fine. He's like standing off to the side. I thought that was pretty funny. Yeah, so like, funny. she was like, I can give you a free hug. <laughs> and I got a free hug. Well, well, got a free, hug. A free hug. No, he got a free hug. I didn't get. Oh, it. I got. A free, he got me a free hug, there, yeah. and that yeah, was a, it. Was a point there. towards him. It was a good point towards him because he got me a hug. All right. Well, and at the end was, of the day, man. I, I mean, I got to see your wiener. Yeah. Did you enjoy the show while it lasted? Right. Of, of, of me running in and out of the bathroom yelling. Can you see my dick? <laughs> the thing was, he, he was like, he was like, can you see my dick? And he starts going like this. Like, <laughs> he's like, can you see it? Like, yeah, I can see it when you do no, that. No, he started going, fucking like, with me. Like, like, like when we got to the convention center, James would like look at me and then like look down like really quick <laughs> and just smirk. And I'd be like, what's funny? He's like, nothing. Well, it went from, <laughs> like, it went from something there. And then he'd start looking down. Yeah, it went from nothing or something there to absolutely nothing there. So it was like, that's why I zoomed in on it because it looks like you like. I was just I was just so self conscious yeah. that whole day afterwards because I didn't know if like it was still visible or not. Yeah, and I was afraid it would like come loose and then I'd be like, "We gotta go back to <laughs> we gotta go back guys, to the hotel guys, right now." We gotta go back to the hotel. Go loose. Oh. oh god. Oh yeah. Well, that was the day we met Stan Lee when we were dressed up in Batman and Robin yeah. outfits. You um, met him. The yeah, ultimate we, irony. Oh, let me go grab that. We got the most really quick. personal experience with Stan Lee. <laughs> yeah. The okay. most personal what, what, experience. What happened? So Dan's gonna whip out that poster that yeah. we uh, we had got got two two of those. I think there's like a hundred of those. He already explained that. Oh uh, yeah, he did. Yeah. Well. So when you were there at so, the meeting. So one one at a time came and there was a line for it. Obviously we went to the front of the line, and we had to take out the poster and everything. And uh, you fucking breaking my tube? It fell. There's is there there's a. His signature is right there. Okay. Yeah, that Jim Stan Lee. Can I see it? Can you make There's it out? There's Stan Lee right there. There's Stan yeah, Lee. That's yeah, Stan Lee all over really the place. Good. It's a lot of Stan Lee. Yeah, I really liked it. Like, it's a really cool print. That's why I got like, it. Like anyway, so we had that whole print. Uh, and then we went to the front of the line, and uh, this guy is, like, chauffeuring us. Take all your posters, and let me see the package here. Let me see the, you know. Because they gave us, like, a referral thing that told us, pretty much said that we could cut in front of the line. Um, <laughs> and so we get through here, and then we get, like, moved behind a couple people, and, uh, all these guys are like yelling at once there's like four dudes there or so and like pretty much what happens is we get up we see stanley signing stuff he's busy away signing things yeah. this guy looks at us he's like okay you're next you're next yeah we're he's like, like all right he was like shoving us along like shit. oh man we're gonna finally get to meet stanley i was just gonna like, you know i was gonna i think you know, I, like i thought i was gonna be like hey stanley you know yeah like, i thought it was just gonna be like, something like that like the, i get to know, shake his hand and he'd be like yeah thumbs up or something like, oh, I no are. this guy takes our posters <laughs> and says i'll get them done for you really quick <laughs> and just takes them away from us cock blocks us from stanley behind him yeah. to where we can barely see Stanley even signing our stuff. That's why he's like, "Are you sure Stanley even signed it?" I'm like, "Yes, yeah, man." Yeah, they walked around the guy that was getting their shit signed, and then just got like the finished product. Two people in front of the table where Stanley was signing, so we just got shoved around those people. <laughs> Posters get back to us, and then we just get pushed out. And it was, was probably like, because we were dressed up as Batman and Robin. And then the guy's like, "You're yeah, dressed up like that to Stanley, huh?" I bet he didn't like that, or he made some comment like that. I, don't know, but <laughs> I was like, I was just shocked. I'm like, was that it? That yeah. is what we paid. Yeah, like, that was a Stanley. I got the like, prints, and we, just we got to see out. Stanley through a guy's back. <laughs> yeah, we got to see over over somebody's shoulder. I was saying, I think I saw more of Stanley than they did. <laughs> yeah. the Probably. But let, me, let me set up this this thing because this is what I was off to the side, like kind of like. I wasn't too far away. Like I was probably just a few feet away. Like there was there was comics, like a, a row of comics yeah, in front yeah. of me, and I could you know I could see Stan like you know straight ahead. But the thing was, while these guys were doing that, the area that Stanley was doing this and just like the atmosphere was the most fucking depressing thing <laughs> that I have seen at Comic Con. <laughs> Poor Stan Lee is sitting there. He was, like, coughing and stuff, and they were, like, <laughs> rubbing his back and shit, and I was like, I was like, oh, my God, like, you know, what is going on? Like, you know, is Stan Lee even in the condition to be doing this shit? He's 90 years old. Like, 
Jesus he is 90 Christ. years old. Give him a he's, break and let him he's go. He's dying. Like, he's dying in his chair while he's signing stuff. Oh, no. Let him go and do whatever he wants to do. <laughs> I was saying how depressing it was because Stan was sitting there coughing and stuff. Like, while he was signing stuff, he's like, Ugh, and they're rubbing his back and stuff. Like, and they're like, you know, like... They're all conformed around him and shit. And like I was ready just to like, revive him at a moment's notice when he starts going into. You gotta a make fit. more yeah. superheroes, please. I was just like, oh my Stand god. Ready. I was like, I can't believe they're letting him like just sit there like this. Like, I, I don't it know why. Terrible hacking cough. He's like, oh. I was like, man, this is super fucking depressing. <laughs> I was like, I don't, I don't. After they got their shit signed, I don't want to be around this. Yeah. As depressing is that? Like, right there. Yeah. <laughs> you, you gotta put like, that picture in the creature yeah. talk or something. You can see what like, the hell we're looking at. Nick Cage. So the worst thing I've seen all day. It's Regardless, inspiration to you right now because you can see it on my face. <laughs> Regardless of the experience of seeing him, <laughs> that's all I keep, That's all I'm looking at this whole yeah. time. Just, Wait, every time bring I up Wesley Snipes. You know, yeah. yeah, whatever happened to him. He, he's been released. Um, let's see here. Man. He's been released he from federal prison where he was serving a three-year sentence after being convicted on tax three charges years. February 2010. That sucks. He's 50 years old now. Oh man, poor guy. Yeah. Anyway. Poor guy. <laughs> of course, they feature uh, uh, Snipes, featured. 50, who starred in Blade action movies and White Men Can't Jump. Oh, yeah, I remember that. <laughs> those are the two movies oh, he's credited That one was really good. That's what I'd want to be remembered for. <laughs> who, who's the guy that he played with, Dan? Who was his uh, like, oh, co-star in White Men Can't Jump? Huh? Uh, Woody, Woody Hurlson. Woody, Woody, Woody Hurlson. Woody Hurlson. Woody Hurlson. I like how it right. says, in June 2012, the U.S. Supreme Court refused to hear an appeal of his sentence while he had argued that his... his uh, his sentencing was too harsh for a misdemeanor conviction. Mm. Three like years for a tax evasion. And then that judge is like, I am not showing that I give uh, preferential treatment to celebrities. You're getting a longer sentence. Yeah. No, he, he wasn't a uh, you know, white girl like Lindsay Lohan. He's, oh, yeah, that gets probation a black for man. killing somebody. Yeah. She killed sure somebody? That, no, no, I'm just saying. Well, say, she could probably, happen. She if probably Wesley Snipes killed kill somebody or did what Lindsay Lohan did, I bet he would have gotten treated She's a lot a harsher rat. than Lindsay, Lindsay like Lohan. Then we have Amanda Bynes who seems on to, the... can, like, do whatever. Yeah, Amanda She's Bynes on the Lindsay, Lindsay Lohan, Lohan train to... <laughs> It's like, well, Lindsay Lohan. James <laughs> Choo-choo. Yeah, Welcome to Miley Cyrus is going to join her pretty soon. Race Wars, Prison Talk. There's going to be a riot. Do you think Wesley Snipes, like... Does the to, black man to. get it worse than the white woman? <laughs> that is the question. Honestly, I like Wesley Snipes better. It's not a hot one. topic that I, I like yeah. to tackle on today's He's better. Oh my god. Oh. Anyway, at the end of the day, the Stanley shit was super depressing. <laughs> <laughs> they got Pretty sad experience, though. apparently. They got autographs. Was he like trying to do you guys a favor? Like, I don't want you guys. I to don't know. feel like you're gonna. No, be no. Like, it no, just no, seemed no. like he was. Everyone. He was rushing us through. He literally was just was like it, trying to get us out of there. Was it everyone that had to just give their thing to him? To there sign were people. I saw fucking people out. talking to him though, and him laughing at their like. Like Stan, Stan Lee, Lee like, could have laughed like, with you. He could have laughed at something. I could have just, hey, I just Stan wanted to Lee. fucking say, like, you know. I think thanks, it's because like nice people paid you. for pictures, and so like people you that took pay pictures. Pay for a picture, like what? Yeah, like if you paid for a picture, you, you could probably have a closer experience. Theirs was more so the price of the print, but but they got the cut in line just was, to get it autographed. It was just the print. It was funny. I there guess was not like interaction a, wise. Awesome. There was like a moment, like somebody, somebody from us was supposed to take a picture, and like they put us in front of them. So they were pushing them out, and he's like, "Where are we supposed to take a picture?" And so this guy is like <laughs> trying to figure out because we're still signing, and he's like, "Got this kid like picture, picture." So he's like, "Just give me the damn thing!" And he takes his like tablet or whatever, and he's just, like posing in front of like trying to take a screen for like you know, <laughs> you know just gives it back to yeah, him. Yeah, gives after a it. terrible picture. It's all blurry. Yeah, and and he's like, get, get out of here. Like, are there, like, give me the damn thing. It's are there, like, like this big different process. Stan Lee packages you can buy there. I, well, like, I, I guess it's I had asked the guy who did the print. I was like, "How'd you get this deal?" And he's like, "Oh, I know Stan." So I guess like you just like did. We got the shit. You pay four hundred bucks, you get twenty <laughs> seconds of idle chit chat. I'm sure, yeah, I'm sure it's like idle <laughs> chit chat. You get a smile from Stan. You get a laugh from Stan. That's an extra twenty dollars. <laughs> you can hand. fucking have him cough on you. <laughs> you can <get laughs> Stan the germs. You can give him a cough drop. <laughs> the official <laughs> Stan. It's like feeding cough. animals at a petting like petting zoo. It's like you'll give him you a one cough of his liver spots if you give him a cough drop. You get to give him a cough drop. It's like a petting zoo. You just like put a quarter in. You get a Halls popped out. Halls, you want to go? No, no. Like, oh, thank you. This is so bad. 
Damn. So bad. Oh, Stanley. Poor Stanley. Stan's gone. Right, you guys took this. <laughs> you made this <laughs> into Stan thing. being an animal. <laughs> Stan being an animal being fed cough drops. What the fuck? <laughs> Is happening here? CT snapshot. <laughs> Ten <laughs> times more depressing. <laughs> right snapshot. Now. Oh man. Well, well, what are you ta- is it the brand of cough drop? Is it weird <laughs> though that when you guys say like petting zoo and stuff like that, the first animal that I see Stan Lee being is a llama? I saw a goat. <laughs> I Did he? I, I, don't I, I don't know why. I, like, do. I think a goat. It's I just like think a Stanley llama. Goat. I don't know why. Stanley goat. A Stan Lee goat taking cough drops and like. Mm, 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 crunch it out. He has so many cough drops. He needs to just crunch them. He can't. Which is more offensive, a llama or a goat? Uh, this whole topic's pretty offensive. Right? <laughs> yeah, What's so offensive about that? I hope someone oh, makes fun of me like that. He put himself in the position of signing autographs. That's what I'm saying. You don't know. I didn't know if it was him. Like you never know if like he, it was like an obligation that he had to be there. He wouldn't there give for us this. our tickets back either. So we have like no proof that Stanley actually signed <laughs> anything of ours. Like no, just, just take a picture of him signing it, but you get shoved away. So it's like, oh, I can't. It's a just a blur. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Just like a blur. See that? That's his mustache right there. Those are his glasses. It was him. It was I, him. I wish you could have seen us in like the Batman and Robin outfit. That would have been probably been like, "Hey, what are you guys doing here?" Or something. But no. I was gonna say because he said you guys came up. I thought as, that would actually Batman. make a semi good. You guys, we we, we got out of the costumes by then, right? We were out of the costumes, weren't we? Were we out of the costumes? By no, then? no, because the guy, co- the guy, when we came out, was like, "Oh, you guys were, you know, you was brought- I out of he's the like, costumes? He's like, you, you brought the wrong I costumes. Was out of the costume. okay. Yeah, you were out of the costumes. You had to change your clothes. I Should guess. be like, no, we know what we were. No, doing. I just had clothes underneath. I you just got gray had a good co- conversation there. Probably, but no, we were shafted <laughs> yeah, by the yes, by the bodyguards of Stan Lee. <laughs> Get shoved down by it's the bodyguards. Three people like managing. Just to run up and see what would have happened. It's like that's my poster. Like there was this other guy that was like doing crowd wall. control and saying no pictures to anybody on the outside too. Like taking no, you can't. Take yeah, yeah. He was like swatting people, no pictures. Like, yeah. no, no pictures. No, no, no flash. Flash photography scares Stan Lee, so please. <laughs> no no it had to be a petting zoo then. It here? sounds like a petting zoo. No fire. No fire. <laughs> it was a real spectacle. To see <laughs> <the feed>. <laughs> <laughs> I never get to that point where it's like. You know, I charge people for idle chit chat and like you get to feed me stuff. Water like, that's talk. pretty much like yeah. Minecon. Here we come. We'll be it's, implementing it's weird. That. It's weird. Like paying for autographs that's from the, other like, celebrities. I've heard that's like the dying career thing. Is you're paying, you're charging for autographs. And stuff. Oh, yeah, yeah I don't poopy. know. It's just like, oh, I'm a big fan. Can you sign this? Oh, yeah, ten 20 bucks. bucks. Twenty bucks. Uh, it's like, well, I'm not okay, a sure. fan anymore, but... Yeah, sure. sure, I got I got 10 bucks. Here, this will support your career. I mean, your is everything career. all right? Like, what? <laughs> yeah, is everything <laughs> all right? Can I take out to dinner or something? I mean, Asking for a kid for money Stanley, to sign Stanley's something? Medical I mean, I don't make seven <laughs> figures a year, but I guess I can give you 10 bucks. I mean... Jesus. Man. I worked hard for this 10 bucks, but I guess it matters more to you. Making Poor seven guy. figures a year. Eight <laughs> figures sometimes. Maybe well, we did done. pay for the... Uh, you paid for the Scarecrow guy, and I paid for the uh, Gur guy. Guy that voices yeah, that's why Gur. it was weird. I was like, because I thought they were just standing there, and then he's like ten bucks. But the, like, the, the, oh. the guy that voices Gur was kind of saying how like they never call. He, he was supposed to do a Gur spinoff show, and they never called him back. And the oh. last thing he did was like a video game from like two years ago. <laughs> so I, I'm assuming spoilers. The voice of Gur is falling on pretty hard times. <laughs> you know. Everyone send Gur ten bucks. <laughs> Find his address. Help him stay afloat. The voice of Scarecrow from Markham Asylum never got called back for Arkham City. So. Uh, yeah, no, he guy. didn't. He was, a, he was a happy guy, though. Was he happy? He was pretty happy. Well, he got 10 bucks from Alex. So yeah, he's, yeah, he's like, hey, the he first kid oh, I I get some McDonald's. He was, he's other I, characters, though. He was like characters in Warcraft and shit, too. Yeah, yeah, right. to I don't have to get like, McDonald's. Oh, he's working I mean, then. He's also working. He's doing Pandaria. I get a cheeseburger. I get a cheeseburger tonight. No more of those dollar menu. The Gur guy was literally just Gur. The hit, like the, his guy was like it, he had a bunch of like other pictures all yeah. spread yeah, out like of other stuff. Troy Baker kind of yeah, not Nolan even, North kind of no, not that far. No, <laughs> that I'm just saying no. like multiple. Those guys charge twenty bucks. For those guys twenty twenty bucks. I really wanted to see Steve again, and I didn't see him at all. I was really depressed. Steve Blom. Well, you so saw random, him last year, just walking by, and he's like sitting. There I know, at that table, but like, like I said, I said if I were to see him, drinking my water here. If I was gonna see him at Comic Con like this past, and I was gonna ask him like. We want you for Trapville right now. Uh, yeah, I guess that's true. But it didn't happen. <laughs> I just thought that was funny. Like, you caught me drinking my water here. Hey, one second, you say that again, and you spun the mic around. Oh, God. What a, what a meeting right there. <laughs> Whatever happened to that? Did it ever get posted anywhere? I don't nope. fucking know. Nope. Not much of the really? Comic-Con nope. stuff from last year did. Yeah, that didn't. That, didn't. that was back when we didn't do actual coverage. Was that day coverage. four? 
Day four. Well, that that was Saturday, so Sunday is the last four. day. Day four yeah, was like the day worst four. day. Of was that that was a food time. fiasco? I actually wasn't it? no. Yeah, the Saturday fiasco night was one of these nights. Saturday night was food fiasco. Day three, right? End of day yeah. three. Day three. I. W- <laughs> we didn't explain this yet. You might want to leave again for this. <laughs> I, think, I think the yeah, delivery will be here this pretty soon. Dude, he tends to leave right when we I start think, talking I think the food him. we ordered from Comic-Con is still yet to be delivered. It's, it's funny because... The food oh, fiasco man. wasn't this just what good. that video was. So you guys named whole, this event. This event has a name, yes. the food fiasco. There was already there's food a, fiasco. There's, there's, a, there's a video there's, for it, but that was like the prelude to, like yeah. I guess, the, the situation that occurred going up afterwards. was just the tip of the iceberg. All right. There was not just one food fiasco. That was the middle ground. The food fiasco. Yeah, the middle ground. James, was, that was the middle. There was never yeah. just one food fiasco. <laughs> there was never just. I know it started with ironically Chinese food. Oh okay. Chinese food. Oh god, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh god, yeah. Okay. Oh so god, I was yeah. Saying, so, I was saying. I was saying we should just order from the place we've ordered before, and like you know we were looking at that and we we're like that was shit. We don't want that. And then he suggested. I think we were talking about Domino's at one point, but then he was no. Like, he want. He he wanted, suggested Chinese. He food. wanted. He wanted Chinese food right the, off the this bat. This Creature he Talk wanted, segment is brought to you by the Yelp app. <laughs> <laughs> he, Alex come, he wants Chinese food, okay? Alex is so hell-bent on Chinese food. For what reason, I don't know, but he wants Chinese food. Must be that Russian so on me, we, can't get, yep. you know, we can't get the chicken figures or whatever that we country. had that we had like the day previously. So I go online on the laptop, and I'm looking through places. I'm looking through Chinese places to get some Chinese food. There's, there's a good amount of Chinese food that, that's listed. I pick one place, you know, pretty much I, I you know, conf- confer with him if this is good or not for him, up to his standards. <laughs> I believe you, 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 you thought it was fine. Oh, absolutely right? fine. You thought it was fine. <laughs> yep. It was going through a website that I was going to order from. Oh, no. <laughs> then we came down to what everybody wanted. <laughs> oh. Alex, by the end of this conversation, Alex is like, just give me whatever you get. <laughs> just give me whatever you get. I was starving at this point. Like, I was straight up yelling because yes. I was, like, really hungry. <laughs> so I start putting in the order, and uh, I don't know if this was the place. There was, there, was, there was two places, two Chinese places that I did on the same site. One of them did not deliver to anywhere beyond, it was like, uh, what was it, like a two-mile radius, mm-hmm. I think it was. And we were, we were pretty much borderline. But as I put, as I put in the order, like, it, didn't, it, it said, like, we don't deliver there or whatever. So then the second place, the second place, by the time, like, I ended up actually ordering those, uh, the second place ended up being closed. So now, at this point, Alex is getting very flustered <laughs> because he doesn't have his Chinese food. So he's threatening, threatening Whoa. to order his own food. Uh oh. He wants to order his own food from where? Where did you? Where did so you originally? I go- call like this like steakhouse place that said they yes. were open, and I had called them. I had like all the. I had gone through the menu. Had this big order in place. <laughs> You know, told him about, they, they start asking me, and then I got this lady, because she's Keep like, in mind, while he's on the phone, he's like, yeah, fuck you guys. Fuck <laughs> you guys. <laughs> the entire, no, I, I think I was with Alex no, a lot of the time. You were going on the website to see what you wanted, because yeah. I had her on hold, okay? <laughs> yeah. She got off hold, and she's like, okay, I think we can still deliver at this time, because they were done delivering, but yeah. the delivery guy was still there. I'm like, okay. And she's like, you're at this, uh, you're at the uh, Continental, or whatever. I'm like, the what? The Continental? Uh no, we're at this this place. She's like, oh no, this is this is the place that we only like do walk walk yeah, deliveries. There's, there's so, the Chinese food. And so they couldn't deliver to to us. They just couldn't deliver. No delivery. Too, too far yes. away. So okay. Well, so he did that. this. He did this about what two or three times. Yeah. He I, called. Yeah, he called two, two or three. Restaurants? He I called two or three different, different places. And one of them, this, I believe it was either the second or the third one that he had called. Did we? Say- they were do. It was doable. They were they were a few blocks away. But Dan at this point did not want to walk to go pick up the food. What? So that what? X is off that. Yeah, oh, that was whoa. that one. Okay. That was that one place. Okay. That was. All right. I did not want to walk. I yeah. just wanted to fucking get food. That's all I you wanted. You didn't want to go to get the food. That one lady said that if you were to come and pick it up, we could have gone to get I it. I don't remember disagreeing to the walking thing. You did. Ask him when he comes back in. That yeah, was like I, I the second that. or the third place. But they said I never at any point refused any of the places you guys were going for. So he was all for it. 
Either way, he was I in. never he was refused in for whatever for we, what I we thought. No, did. I, I thought at a certain point that that place was out the door for some reason. There like, was I a never... place that was they that Alex had said like we could go and pick it up. Alex, yes. Wasn't there a place that you had called one of the three places where they said we could go pick it up? Yeah. But did Dan I not want to do it? Yeah, Dan didn't want to do it. Was that hindering on me not wanting to do it? He said he didn't want to walk, right? He wanted to edit or something like that. I don't think any of us wanted to walk. I was waiting to edit. I was waiting to use the computer to edit. And that, At this point in time, this, I was running on yes. no fuel. This all, sta- <laughs> this all started at 8. This all started at like yelling. 8. This all started they made the vine of me screaming into a pillow. Oh, yeah. The, <laughs> and I said, Alex is hungry. <laughs> I was like, but, no, but I, I remember, like, he, you said, he was like, well, we could go and get it. And Dan was like, oh, I have to edit. I have to I was edit saying stuff. I had to edit. Yeah, well, that in saying that, it's like, okay, you Okay, I guess it, you guys assumed that I wouldn't but want But this wasn't even it. Chinese food. If you point. have to edit, you can't go to get food and edit at the same time. So you have to do one or the other. This all started at 830, by the way. Yes. And it was like 11 o'clock before we even okay. finally so got food. Okay, so he wanted to edit. Like I said, he didn't want to go okay, get the food. That, so I might have and <laughs> we had to meet Luke at some point, so we were yes. on a time frame. We were kind of on a time frame. We this were kind of on a time frame. At this attempt. point, I was saying, so I was this like, was like know, the fifth or sixth failed yes. attempt of food, so and I like picked, the second I had failed two attempt. Chinese places. He had three restaurants. Three for everybody? Yeah. Why are you eating food right now? I'm bringing it to you guys. What the? I don't want to. I don't want to eat on the fucking on the podcast. We still have like a fucking hour left. No, we don't. We're going to buzz through this. I'm anyway, 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 you know, we'd do Mexican, but you didn't want Mexican No, I, I didn't food. want Mexican. Yeah, he didn't. Somebody didn't want Mexican. No, I didn't want Mexican. There was always something that, like, I, got I don't mind Mexican. I, saying, I always get the same Mexican if shit anyway, tacos. like, every single time. I was getting to the Delicious point tacos. constantly where I was like, you get what you want, I will order Domino's. Like, yeah. I was ready to order Domino's now, at any moment. He else. kept saying <laughs> that, but he <laughs> never <laughs> ordered no, Domino's. because you guys kept like, There was a lot of threatening going on. threatening each other. threatening going back and forth. I Domino's right now. I didn't want to get Domino's by myself. If somebody else wanted Domino's, I would have ordered Domino's. But every time someone got a lead, everyone was just, an issue by everyone himself. was just like, jump on board. Like, like with James, we're just like, hey, what, what else do they have there? Like, <laughs> or like with me, they started like pulling oh, up the menu. Leave, and leave. like with Domino's, I it was like, oh, like, I want Domino's do, now. Do, Domino's sounds do, pretty good. Do they have mozzarella sticks? <laughs> they have mozzarella sticks. I never wanted Domino's. I had said that I wanted fucking Mexican. I wanted a fucking burrito or something uh, like that. But that no one was for that. So then it was just a, a regular deli hoagie, like, you know, sub place or whatever. But on the site, again, it said it was closed. So this time I fucking, I, I had called. And that order went through. However, it turns out, I guess an order, I, uh, it was another, there was another hoagie place. This must have been There's like a place you ordered place. online. Yeah, there was, there was another, it was another order that I had went through, like, I guess, kind of all the way through that they had said they were closed, but somehow the order went through anyway. Okay. No, no, no. He finished the, the order. order. Went through, and it, it went. Like, it went through to the next day after right. oh, after okay, I realized okay. it. Like, oh, they, like there was no. He was ordering yeah, within the last time. minute before they were done taking orders. And it, wasn't, it, it wasn't the last minute. It was like 10, 20 minutes. Well, no, like ten. <laughs> it was less than ten, probably. There was. There. It wasn't like yeah, yeah, on yeah. the dot though. But I. I kind of figured they wouldn't be able to deliver it in it's worth you know, a shot, ten though, minutes or all this. That is but I figured in in doing this, I figured that there would be a notice where it's like, okay, we have to reschedule for tomorrow because I think you know fucking Buffalo Wild Wings does that where it's like you know we have to adjust your time accordingly it'll come tomorrow yeah, yeah. there was no information <laughs> like that it just went through so I was like what the fuck then it says on the confirmation that it'll be here tomorrow morning at 8 so I was like well I guess we're good for food for tomorrow <laughs> morning <laughs> All right. and then uh, there was a, the, 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 the by this time it was probably like the 7th or 8th place I finally <laughs> called them they're good to go so then, while Alex was over here, he was hell bent on getting his own food. He quick runs over, James, please, please give me food, James. James, please, I, I'm sorry, let me get food, please. You have to order me something. I, I'm not gonna deny that. Like I was, I wanted something. Exactly. I was really hungry. I was so everyone scrounges around after I got these people on the phone to finally pick something from the menu real quick. We get this order in. Then these motherfuckers from the morning place call me and text me. A million times, 
he calls me, finally gets a hold of me, and I was like, you know, hello or whatever, and he's like, um, he says, yeah, he just placed an order a little bit ago. It was scheduled for tomorrow. We're, we got a guy coming over there right now. He's bringing it to you. <laughs> So now we have two orders of food coming. Before I even get a chance to say anything, click. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so now we have two orders of food coming <laughs> to the same hotel. Fiasco, 2013. We have two <laughs> orders coming. This is where it gets really good as to what kind of character James is. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what you mean by that. Well, we'll hear it in a second. The one, the one that I actually called. They came. They they brought everything. We were sitting there eating. It was done or whatever. Then uh, I guess it turns out I was getting text messages from the people that they were downstairs, like at the delivery thing. Like they were waiting to deliver the food, which is oh, weird when no. you think about it because the other guy got in just fine. But this guy apparently did they not didn't get in. They didn't have a room number or something like that. Yeah. Well, yeah, because he ordered it with his name, but the room was under your name. So there's no way that they could like ask like – you know, is this pr- like is James yeah. here if it's under you know Dan's name? Yeah. So even so if I guess you went they were out the there. Desk. They were out there waiting for like a good twenty minutes or so, and I guess they eventually left. Damn. The people that were originally scheduled to come in the morning, anyway. Uh, so I I had went downstairs to get like change or something like that, and I talked to the security guy that was that was down there, and I was like telling him I was like you know. We had ordered food. Was there somebody down here waiting to get in or whatever? And he was like, oh, yeah, he waited out here for like 20, 30 minutes or something like that. And he left. He called his boss and left or something like that. He said they were trying to get a hold of you or something like that. I explained the entire situation to him. And I tell him how we've been trying to get food and how I ordered from them online. It carried over into tomorrow. Then I called a place and got them to bring us food now. <laughs> and I was like, it doesn't make any sense. They called me up and just said that the food was on its way either way. So... Whatever. They never came. And uh, it turns out, I guess, the reason they were scrounging for everything was I got an email where it said that the credit card actually didn't go through anyway. So they were bringing this food without even getting a payment anyway. The card didn't go through. (laughs) So they were bringing all this food, I guess, expecting me to give them the card there. So all the food was made. I guess they brought it. They took it back and they... They ate it themselves. <laughs> but James next morning is like, I'm trying to figure out whether they charged me for this food or not. <laughs> like, after this delivery man comes out, sits in the lobby 20 minutes, well, has the, his food the, all the ready to go. Well, the security guy told me, he's like, he's like, that's not right. You should check and see, like, if they charge you because they should have charged you for that. Because it was pretty much on them. After we're eating the food, like, there must have been an hour. James is like, my boss, I got a bunch of messages here. <laughs> <laughs> and then he just puts it down. Or no, he texts back. He t- the I did, I texted like, back. Hey, which room are you? And he's like, he texts back, 204. Doesn't, doesn't <laughs> call back, like, yeah, we're up in here, or whatever. Oh. Text back, yeah, come bring it. <laughs> like, <laughs> well, at this point, like you said, it was like an hour later. Like, they're probably long <laughs> gone by now. Like, what the fuck wow. am I going to do? Hey, that was a really, really pissed off food Booked place down. that night. Because <laughs> we ordered, like, 60 bucks worth of food. <laughs> and this kid, like, drive out at, like, Twice. way past closing time. <laughs> and sit in the lobby for, like, half an hour. <laughs> with no payoff. But I wouldn't have been that, like, it was only under the pressure of this fucking asshole <laughs> that it had to be a so specific type of food. It's my fault. It's your fault. Specific no, type of food. Yeah, because on top of it that. It started off as on like, top of you that. guys, no, no it started off. No, 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 on top of this, on top of this while I'm ordering, do they have chocolate chip cookies? <laughs> do they have cookies? Do they have mozzarella sticks? <laughs> Can I get mozzarella no. sticks? Because I really like mozzarella oh, sticks. Chocolate man. chip cookies. That sounds some, like, some pretty dire needs right there for your <laughs> food. It, it, it started off as like he's so he's so drained, he's so but yet yeah, he's not drained. drained enough to get a chocolate chip cookie. Do I get a chocolate chip cookie? <laughs> oh, what? Well, hey, 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 doesn't matter. He fucking took it and crushed it up in front of my face and threw it at me <laughs> later on anyway, that so I true. couldn't eat it. That's totally no, true. There's been, been plenty of times. Like that, I did. There's been plenty of times where James has pulled off stupid things, like the time at RTX with the whole burger incident and stuff like that. So. <laughs> burger <laughs> incident. Yeah, where you ordered that burger and then you didn't touch it. 
And, and oh yeah, yeah, yeah. The, 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 the fucking when we, when we walked up. down to meet them. Oh, the, oh. <laughs> Sly no, did I didn't touch though. it. I took Sly a bite did that as well, it. though. He ordered a burger and like he ordered a whole morning. burger. Sly ordered room service and left it. That's yep. way I, more expensive. I asked. I woke him up four times for his for his burger. That is way. And he got mad in. in the morning. He's like, "Why didn't you guys wake up?" I woke like, up four times. Like I recall walking in on everyone just feasting on room service in the other room at RTX, and I was like, "Oh, this is great." Well, the thing was, I think we paid for it though. Like I wanted I wanted chicken nuggets. No? Then he wanted quesadillas. I saw that bill. Everybody wanted chicken nuggets, pretty much. I always get fingers. quesadillas. And like, then you suddenly wanted quesadillas. You're full of shit. It started off as like, do you, you guys just want? Eat the do you guys just want Chinese food too? James, give me something on that fucking menu right now. <laughs> and then the oh, talk, talking, I was talking about RTX, but yeah, yeah. Mm. You did get quesadillas at fucking mm. at, mm. at I got Comic Con too. Every single night uh, at RTX, I got quesadillas. <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, <laughs> I don't know why. Like, I, I don't know why he wanted. He I have a weird obsession it. with quesadillas. So I don't I really know why wanna, he wanted more quesadillas. Talk about. I had a quesadilla last night. It was pretty good. Did you? Yeah. Oh was it chicken quesadilla? It was. All right, it's pretty it good. But then, the leading into the, like, or, or leading out of the the food, the bad food, we decided to treat ourselves on the last day. Oh yeah, <laughs> I saw Jordan, that. Jordan <laughs> actually asked me what that was. <laughs> I, what saw, that was. I saw a receipt on my desk that was just ridiculously Albies. expensive. I was like, Albies. how? How is this this expensive with three people? Eating? Jordan, Jordan, and then we had a discussion where we were like, what's the most expensive thing? Jordan, here? I don't, I don't know if you, I don't know if you know this, but we parked in the garage. Yeah, so. we parked in Damn. the garage. That was um, a, I'd still like to be get comped for that. Um. Comp Alex's garage <laughs> bill. Yeah. Comp Got a lot of Alex. comping to do. There you go. Garage. I still need my Need for Speed stuff from like last year. <laughs> <laughs> Join the list. You gotta, you gotta queue up for it. A copy yeah, but then Twitch speed. reimbursed you. And you said you were gonna give me 60 bucks because I went out and bought a game right there. Remember that? Well, you weren't there. Remember that? This need for Speed thing? Yeah, I remember yeah. when I kicked it over and I, I went out and bought that. one. Reimbursed. Yeah. <laughs> well, I see the top of the list. Wait a minute. Because huh? it's full of this. That was like last yeah, year. Yeah, but we're, this, is, this is this is a queue status. You can't just... That was like last summer. Favorites. I queued last year. I queued after James. And that, you just skipped the 2012. You I never queued. queued. He's this is the, the queue. official he queue. Was, he's already been in the queue. He's just rewriting it for that list's purposes. Thank you. All right. Well, then I guess... Anyway, then I, I don't know how far we're down the list. Then. Well, I too was in the queue last year Yeah, we're over two hours at this point. I kind of want to end it. We have a few other topics, but... We still have more Comic-Con to go, but... We do? Well, the last day you guys walked around the floor, I hung out with Daniel Baxter all day. Yes. There we go. That's it. That's the Comic Con stuff. I'm starving. That was I'm it. Looking over at our food right now. Wow, you. What the hell? That's, That's why I was weird. gonna fucking. I figured you guys were gonna eat a little bit. While I wonder how many people so watching this them. got up and got food because we made them hungry just by talking about food. Yeah, so, so, so. Talk ends and now this. Is hungry. And the last thing <laughs> is we talked one, about food, and then we talked now. about food again here. The food. Pack it up, pack it up. There's a few topics on here we'll talk about later. Get ready for a slate of new content. All right. Meow, 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 meow. <gasps> is, it, is this how really how you're ending it? I'm hungry. Do you want to end it any other fashion? How about we actually continue talking about the things we, that we have on the topics list? And so that's why I was saying before there's still like an hour left in this. But no, 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 no. Which I guess it isn't. Like Jordan wants to end it right now. Should we take a vote? Man, this is this is a rough vote. This is a sad ending, I think. It's almost yeah. as depressing as Stan Lee. <laughs> <laughs> and that Nicolas Cage Superman. Right. Excelsior! Yeah, yeah, Excelsior! Excelsior! <laughs> Excelsior. Stan. That's pretty. That's pretty depressing. That's Stan Lee. Well, how long is it going to take to get through the rest of these topics? Like, we can really? blow through these topics. Like blow them right now. I don't think. Any of these are going to take that long. New Danny song in the works. So you go for... <laughs> <laughs> He's done now. So he goes from the bottom. No, I go for the star, the <laughs> important the star. items. The There's important only one items. star on it. Thank you for Danny. joining us for Creature the Talk. <laughs> Did you guys know that I wrote a will before I got on the plane Did for Comic-Con? It was one serious? of the reasons why you were running late. Really? It's like yeah. a serious will? Like, I'm, like a serious you will. You weren't going to mention that. <laughs> I talked That's about bringing depressing. it up. I just remember James linking me a video of a plane crashing. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Alex wouldn't have gotten on that plane if he had seen I that. I kind of wish. Did you link oh, the, it was, the, it was the a lady? It was a Southwest plane. The lady that was using a phone, she's like filming, and they ended up yeah, crashing. Yeah. There was a, shortly after we got back, a Southwest plane crashed, and someone was inside recording. I don't know why. They While they were landing, like and it was landing, it was just like. <laughs> it was like no, 
was just like, like, no one had a reaction. It wasn't. Yeah, that was shocking that they their plane was on fire and they were just like sitting there like chilling out like, oh. You yeah. see someone put, come out with a hose and they're like, <laughs> Southwest the stocks fuck? dropped pretty heavily that day. <laughs> Did they? Yeah. Wow. When there was like fire on this plane as it was crashing, the stock charges like, started <laughs> growing <laughs> down. <laughs> so so so. Uh. All right, so Danny, Danny song, Danny, Danny song. What's, what's in the works. Excited I don't for that. Know what, he's just been kind of teasing it back. He's and teasing. Forward. He's been he's know. been officially tweeting about it. He's saying that there is a song coming up, but it is a, a secret. I've said so. it before. If it is as good quality as like the whole Just Rain like uh, Sick Kick remix stuff, I'm I'm done with Danny. Well, Sick he's Kick, the Sick mainstream. Kick remix was pretty legit though. You got it. Was, it was a pretty it was good cool, remix. It was pretty but good. But the if fact they could that like Danny amazing go go away from his roots. I think Danny is a quality of his own. So I don't think anybody can make Danny sound. Good. He needs to stay Danny quality, otherwise he, I'm done with him. Like, who wants to listen to good music from him? What are you talking about? I listen to amazing music from Danny every day. Why would I want to listen to good music? Right, right. Um, I don't know. Like, I'd like to see Amazing Person get remixed. That'd and Taku Talk, cool. I'd like to see Taku that be like a DND or, a, lot of or a drum and bass, uh, you know, remix for that. That'd be pretty cool. Uh, I had mentioned this. We have a new slate of content coming this month. So, yep. Yep. active, active hub. Um, Payday 2 beta was, Very was good. released, and it's awesome. I like it a lot better than the first game. Having a blast with it, except the level resets whenever they update, awesome. which kind of sucks, See, and I lose masks. And Payday, the first Payday to this is what Dead Island should have been to Riptide. Yep. That's exactly the progression. A good idea, a little rough around the edges. They completely, but they from the beta, just knocked it out of the park. Not Dead Island Riptide park. did not. This beta is like awesome. It's awesome. It's fun. It's a lot it's, better than the than the original. It's really game. great. So uh, I've been giving out beta codes. The Overkill guys gave us a ton of beta codes to give out. So I've been giving them out. Uh, it releases here in like a week and a half. Mid August. Yeah, mid August is for the Xbox Somewhere and PS3, there. and then like the 27th for Steam. So all the way up until the 27th, they're gonna have the beta live. So Yay. it's gonna be you know a good amount. So be watching for stuff. I actually just got done not a few days ago ordering a full batch of these guys. So we'll see how long that takes. <laughs> Hopefully um, not super long. Hopefully we'll have them at some convention coming up soon. Yeah, yeah. Maybe like sometime uh, soon. We have, yeah. uh, Spoilers. Yeah, there's only so many. Coming we have um, uh, what's it called? Uh, what's it called? A payday two video that went up uh, yesterday of me, Seamus, Z, and James playing a few games. Uh, it's fun. The, a couple interesting things happened, including a couch, a couch, a parking meter, parking meter. Seamus, a never before up. done jewelry heist. Yep, that Seamus screwed up by paying a parking ticket and making well, making sure we didn't get a park. There goes oh. that. There goes that. <laughs> He's dead. Oh no, are you okay? Well, He's dead. There goes that. Uh, the other thing, the, the whole beard competition will be coming here soon. So, you watching yeah, out for that. Are you going yours out? You're like, what are you? <laughs> Damn, man. You must be really... I'm getting hungry. <laughs> yeah, you must I'm be I'm running hungry. low on His body's now. just like shutting like down. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I don't, think, I don't think you ever mentioned like uh, like yeah. your beards at all because this this is we. I think you only saw me once or twice in this. though. I think the live stream mentioned we, it. We but, mentioned uh, it on the live yeah. stream. We also but, yeah, we're content. we're doing a, a creature beard competition, um, and it should be going up here soon. It's actually been a lot of fun going through it and stuff. And yeah, uh, we accidentally posted the first one when we shouldn't have. Oops. So. Yep. That's Whoopsies. why. That's why it went away. It'll be back soon. It'll be sorry. Back. It's a little more, more refined, and then second video is done, which was a blast. Second video is a lot longer than the first. Yeah, but it was fun, was it not? It was very fun. Um, it's even fun to edit for the most part. Well, hey, there you HDCP go. <laughs> Xbox One. What happened, Seamus? They are not doing it. Apparently, they want to keep it open for like external programs to record gameplay. It would seem so. So you're th- saying we can capture games on the Xbox One? Yep. Yeah. Whoa. By Microsoft coming this yep. November. HDMI. Yep. HDMI. That was Brought kind of a, by the Microsoft Surface. It was kind of a big thing that people were talking about. At least people who record stuff because like it doesn't have anything else besides an HDMI cable. So yep. people are like, well, if they have this in place, then you're gonna need a workaround, which there are workarounds available, but it just would have been a hassle. Uh, I have no idea if the PS4 is gonna have it though. Who knows? They had PS3 had it. PS4 yep. might have it. Well, at least the PS3 had like the. It'd be smart for the PS4 yeah, to have it. I would say so. I would say it would be a very, very smart move on Sony's behalf. Very sticklerish of them since they had the whole thing with the PS3. Yeah, like the PS3 kind of gets a free pass because like when the PS3 came out, like no one was really recording a lot of stuff. Like it wasn't as big as it is now. Right. But fast forward like six, seven years, the community's kind of gotten a little bit bigger. You know what I've noticed though too is like 
when we went to the E3 stuff, and I think I mentioned this to James, like, they're having people do the demonstrations as if they were Let's Playing the game. Oh, really? Have you, like, you didn't notice? Did you watch, like, the Destiny? What was that? Is that a doorbell? That oh, my, oh that, was my, that was my uh, my tablet here. Oh, okay. Is that it dying? No, I got a, a shirt sale. Wow. Oh, anyway, yeah, um, yeah, like the Destiny stuff, yeah, for, like the like, division, LP like style. they literally have people that sit there. Because I, I tried to watch the division trailer again, and they're like, and they they're, they're like role playing it, yeah. like they're like, oh, we got two enemies in the left. You better watch out. All right, I'm hey, throwing a smoke out, bomb. That's what our are you doing over there. Yeah, we started that. But they're like now, like that's how they, what they're doing they to sell, it. like to push their product, you know. So it's it's funny that. Like they they know that this is a thing, but they're just still like. It's like, is like there it's any way to drop a weapon down? Oh yes, there is. Why? Yeah. Yes, there is. <laughs> it's funny you should ask. Look over at me in game here, and oh look at that. And like in the comments section, I was reading it. People were like, "Yeah, if only people played like this, the there'd, there'd be like a lot more cursed, you know, swearing and everything." HDCP thing? Yeah, yeah. We, th that's kind of what we're talking about right now. That's kinda, the point of this conversation. It's segued. It's segued. It's kind of segued into some other talks and such, and. Uh, you what know, that enables us to keep doing what right we're there? doing. What's this right here, Alex? That you oh, so they're enablers. Even they're enablers. So the Daisy standalone, we have more information on that. Oh, good. Um, a dev blog was released by <gasps> Dean Hall yes. last night. Hey, yes. Dean the Rocket Hall. Dean the Rocket Hall. Uh, it's like a 17-minute dev blog that shows some of the newer stuff. But um, they're, they're trying to shoot for, I think, winter. For, oh, my for the God. Release. Wait. Winter 2013 or winter? I think I think this like winter, early winter. <laughs> so we're gonna we're gonna shoot for the quarter quarter four quarter, quarter one four, right? late, between. Late it was winter last year. It was summer this year. This is Max Payne all over. Now again. it's winter. It's pushed back. Max Payne all over. Again. Winter. I don't. This is. This <laughs> it is Max Payne all over. It's winter cell conviction. Oh, sometimes geez. sometimes there's just so much refining that you have to do, and just making the game better as a whole that yeah. you have to just keep or completely scrapping the game and there's then so many, like, you never people really that know. are just in the alpha dicking around too, mm -hmm. like while we while we talk, like there's people that are in the alpha just dicking around, having a ball with it. Mm. I'm upset. Interesting. See you this winter. This winter. Are you talking to Daisy? This winter. I see how long this has been going. Yeah. <laughs> are you talking directly to <laughs> Daisy? I'm not talking to you, in case you're wondering. I wouldn't like that anyway, to be Good. honest. Why right. are you drinking my water? Well, we blasted through those water. topics. Yeah, that, those were really That's short. There wasn't much to talk about. You blew that those is also good. my water. Blew those topics. Blew them. Blew right through. Blew them so hard I they didn't know what was that. happening. Yeah. Okay, Mr. Carl, <laughs> you want to end this off here? You want to end this off here, Mr. Carl? <laughs> He's got like little nubby arms. He does. Like little hands. With no <laughs> arms. It's like Master Shake. <laughs> Just has hands. Are we gonna do any any book segments or any uh, question segments? Can't find the book. Books around. You, you can't find the book. You told me the book was over. You there. Must, I thought it was. You must really not want to eat. I do want to eat. I mean, we've only been going for what two hours, fifteen minutes. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. I mean, we for another forty-five minutes. Whatever. We'll take questions for fifteen minutes. Are you kidding me right now? From the people that have been part of the live stream and were not able to watch. Yeah, I was part of the live stream too. All two hours of it, plus an hour before. Yeah, this is like five hours of creature talk we've been trying to do. Uh, <laughs> There's a meeting after this, you know. Oh, uh, oh no. I will shoot myself. There's a, There's a meeting after meeting. this. I will shoot myself if there's a meeting. We already had a meeting. We no. had a meeting at the end no, of the month. This is another meeting. No, no, no. I mean, this I have a meeting a week, though. Like, I brought this a is notebook a, with stuff. This is an official Saturday meeting. I was prepared. After creature talk, I was prepared. Off the clock. If we're going to tack it on, then it's going to be today, because I. <laughs> <laughs> Dan I'm, is looking very upset. I'm going to blow my brains out. We don't have to do the Dan, that is not something you should say. I am not coming I'm down here on you always another fake kill yourself tomorrow. to do a meeting. Tomorrow. <laughs> I'm doing it uh, right it's now. Tomorrow. On Creature Talk, we're having the meeting right now. <laughs> okay, guys. Uh, All right. What are some things you want to discuss? Seamus? I, I can't reach my notebook. I would I would like for you to get a haircut to look more presentable. <laughs> yeah. For for the creatures. <laughs> yeah. I'd like you to comb your hair, Alex, so you too will look more presentable. Well, are we gonna I wrap this up? I could work on combing this my hair a lot more. Do one question. Oh boy. Just one lucky person. One lucky person. Ooh, one, one lucky, lucky individual person. that James will pick. Mm. Mm. I'm gonna pick the worst one. Just hurry up. It's gonna be something about Brinker. <laughs> <laughs> there is one talk about Brinker. <laughs> Par for the course, oh, usually. Man. I'm trying to find a different one. One that we don't get all the damn time. 
don't know. Kind of hard. Like we've gotten most a lot of wide range of questions we have. Uh, Whatever happened to blank series? Whatever happened to Baby Jane? I don't know. What did happen to her? Yeah, what did happen? I don't know. There was a whole movie about it. Oh yeah. Yeah. So like a documentary or? Yeah, it was called Whatever Happened. No, it's not a documentary. It's a it's a it's a fictional film. But okay. Yeah. 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 Well, yeah. I don't really yeah. care what happened then if it's fictional. Well, I mean, well, do you not care about video games then? Because that's fiction. Have you ever seen a documentary no, video game? Well, no, this is the person. Games are fictional. Yeah, some of them are based on like true events. Yeah. But like, this is a fictional person. Right. Like, I don't, I don't yeah, really know much Jane. about her, so I don't really care about her. Like, so you baby, don't care about I don't even like children either. Like, is it a baby? So, so I don't like babies. You don't care about about any. Of the, well, yeah, that is true. You did want to stab babies and stuff like that. Yeah, it's the baby stabbing simulator. Like, yeah, yeah. Where the I just don't know where the line ends. Yeah. Like it's just blurred for me. Yeah. So the uncanny valley. Yeah. You know, I care about video games though. Like you know. Characters oh, in The Walking man. Dead, I got pretty attached to. <laughs> yeah, some of them. Uh, someone just said. Uh, someone just said to discuss further planning uh, about other events and conventions, uh, especially Minecon and uh, uh, what is that? CGM? We're attempting Minecon. We are attempting Minecon. Attempting, attempting. Minecon. We're Attempt. hoping to. That's get, up in the air. Hoping to get Still. panel and booth if possible. Attempting. Attempting. It if is an possible. attempt. So ideally, both. I plan guess. for us not to be there right now. I don't. And if know we how are, it's a special surprise. <laughs> I think yes. at this point, it's completely sold out. So probably, yeah, it's sold out within like three seconds. Yeah, we're not gonna be able to get any like. They're probably like, <laughs> okay, we got a ticket. <laughs> Just like macroing F five to refresh. <laughs> The, the, somebody has a script to yeah, get people, tickets. I was just like, say, they they just run, refresh like, code it. and script to like refresh, and then when it gives the option, it'll click on it and like reserve it instantly. Yep. Yeah. They went so, hard. I guess we'll see. And obviously, Pax Prime. Pax Prime. I think we're all going to be there. Yep. Barring any unfortunate circumstances like uh, a bad luck streak or me or not crashing getting, Southwest. Prime. We also yeah. tried to get a panel we, for that <laughs> as well. Or me not getting my passes until one day into the convention, like what happened with Pax East. Got my passes Friday, I think, and then stuff started on Friday, so that was good. It's okay, really Carl. Cool. It's okay. It's okay, Seamus. That was pretty disappointing. It's okay, no, Carl. I understand. That was just, like, twisting the knife. Hey. Like, you guys all went to PAX. Well, hey. Well, some of you guys went to PAX. Hey, listen. Everyone, who went to PAX? Everyone go to PAX? I'm here for you. PAX yeah. East? Yeah. I didn't go. I'm okay. here for and you. He was there, too. I went, care. Right? He went, right? Yeah, he, he was there, too. I care. He yeah. was a creature at the time. Like, it was, just, it was just my luck. That like, here's some PAX passes. Yeah. I Someone care, asked though. what's your personal favorite convention to go to. PAX Prime. PAX has been pretty cool. Because of Seattle. I like Seattle. Seattle was cool. Boston Seattle sucks. wasn't really anything special, though, when we went. Why are you talking well, about... Well, it didn't rain. It didn't rain or anything. Why would you talk about Boston like that? I was pretty upset about it that. sucks. Jordan. Boston is amazing. He's from Taxachusetts, you know? I am, too. How dare you? Taxachusetts. Yeah. I like it there. <laughs> what do you like good. about it? The about taxes? What particularly? Yes. What particular? <laughs> he always complains about, about Boston's like twelve percent culture or something. The culture is terrible. It's absolutely not. Boston. I love going have to the Boston. Worst accents. And I love seeing oh the sports jerseys on everyone. Here we go. I love listening to, to people talk about clam chowder. And chowder. <laughs> clam chowder. I love chowder. Haymarket. It's chowder. Haymarket is fun. Chowder. It's got tons of like little treats you can buy. The fact that there's a Dunkin' Donuts. The, the, the fact that they have to have Dunkin America Donuts runs on, on Dunkin' though. On opposing sides of the street because too, people are too lazy to make a left turn. That it's, is stupid. It's efficient. Why? It's, it's, it's more I efficient. I liked it Dunkin' is. Donuts when we went, so I yeah, have no problem. Yeah, he liked Dunkin' Donuts. It's, but no, Dunkin' Donuts is fun. The fact you have to build two across the street. Are you from trying each to other. be offensive today? I am trying to be talking super about their offensive. You're not selling Boston. You're not selling Boston very well right now. I cannot stand Boston's accents. Well, don't ever go to Chicago because there's like a Walgreens across the street from each other. We go pack the car. We're going to pack the car. It's wicked dark outside. It's wicked dark. Wicked dark. I'm going to pack the car. Turn on the headlights. Pack the car. Let's pack the car over there. Get some lobster. I think so. yeah, how come you don't say wicked? Right uh, no, like, somebody know. asked me, like, actually, like, uh, do people say wicked in yes, Colorado? Yes, they do. And I was like. <laughs> oh, in Colorado? Yeah. Oh, no. You never heard anyone no, say wicked? No, they say, like, boss. And yeah, they say The boss. way people see, say wicked in New England compared to they say, like how much they would say it here. I've heard it like once. What would or you twice. do if you met yeah. Ben Affleck? I'd punch him in the face. <laughs> <laughs> Tom Cruise. What about your boy Matt Damon face. or Mark Wahlberg? Mark Wahlberg. Marky Mark. 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 
Mackie Mac. Mikey Mike. Mackie Mac. Mackie Mac. All uh, kinds of offensive things. <laughs> Bernie and Phil's there you furniture. Go. Leaves Jordan's Bernie furniture. Bernie and Phil's quality, quality comfort, comfort and price. price. That's, That's nice. nice. I hate them so much. <laughs> I was about to say, I think they just connected. It's like I a, hate them. Some bonding going on. I hate them. I hate them so much. No, in the car on the way back from... Uh, he was playing so... It was I remember, I remember. E3. So we have, at this point, we have lost our Russian fans. <laughs> We have lost our Detroit fans. We've lost yeah, our Stan Lee fans. We've lost our Boston, Boston fans. Stan Lee fans. The, Stanley Stanley fans. Boston Boston. Boston. Hey, hey, hey. the Puerto Rican fans think we don't know they exist. <laughs> <laughs> what else have we thrown out the window? Uh, the Stan Lee point? fans. The I, Stan Lee <laughs> fans. It'd be interesting to see how many Puerto Rican fans we don't have for this episode since Sly's not here. Just if oh, there yeah. was like a demographic for it, like this episode. <laughs> James, wasn't does due James, that much does James not Puerto provide Rico enough? Today? James, no, James pulls a little James bit doesn't of provide Puerto enough Puerto Rican coverage. A little bit of them. A little bit of the Puerto Rican ob- uh, audience. <laughs> no, like, you, I'll oh, take Boston. it. He does a little bit. He does a little Boston, bit. Boston, Good enough Boston, for me. Clam oh, chowder. And they off on a very uh, like, they, I mean, they have some of the freshest seafood, obviously. Well, we, should, the freshest really, seafood. we should look at the. We should look at a map on our like on our YouTube stats and just watch as the colors go <laughs> from green to red <laughs> in specific states at a time. Because this is what this is the path we're headed now. I'm sure after Minecon, if we do get to go, we'll probably say bad things about Florida people. <laughs> That would just go right the other? Bob's that? furniture, right? Bob's furniture. Bob's furniture. That guy made me so upset. If the Red Sox hit a home run. <laughs> what? <laughs> they always used to advertise, like, they'd say, like, if the, the Red Sox would, like, hit a baseball at a if certain Swarks, part of the sign. If the Sox hit uh, a home run, they knock out a homer here, we will give you free... Popcorn or whatever yeah, it's a stupid thing if like, you go in the store. If you buy the furniture for that year, they they give it to you free or whatever. So it's, oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah. No, they won the World Series. You got free furniture from uh, I think it was Jordan's furniture, right? Yeah, yeah two thousand three must have been a good year. Yeah, the way they they won it and people got free furniture that year. Yep, I couldn't believe it. They actually did it and they were more, they were marketing that the Red Sox would lose, so they wouldn't lose all this money. But they Jesus. they lost. Right, and this they, is this. This Holy is why you got, that's why you love New England. Boston. This is why you gotta love New England. I think James just, is checked out from this creature. Show. I'm just like England. rolling around. I'm not a part the, of this Boston. The hate. The I hate. I like Boston. Boston. Boston was pretty nice. You didn't live there. Well, yeah, I didn't <laughs> live there. You didn't live there. The one Man. good thing I can Therefore, hold on you to. You can't like it. James. Sal's Pizza was the best pizza I've ever had in my life. And it still, it still is. That's a plus. Sal's Pizza was amazing. You remember mm. Sal's? I've had Sal's. Sal's Pizza was the best pizza I've ever had. Please send me Sal's pizzas. Send uh, Sal. the Boston people to send you <laughs> Sal's pizza <laughs> for Jordan. He'll be please. poisoned. Sal's Dan already clocked out over there too. <laughs> <laughs> I think he might everyone's well, clocked out. Might as well one clock by one. Sal's James is gone. Dan, I don't like I, Boston. I think we're I think we're done here anyway, at this point. Anyway, thanks for joining us. I think, I'm gonna go eat. Yeah, I think oh, I think we're crap. done. Go I will socks. I I will go say socks. Go I, I think we can Let's wrap it up Fox here, boys. boys. White Sox. Let's, Let's go to Foxborough, boys. Let's get us sell some clam Let's chowder. Get some chowder. 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 Yeah. chowder. 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 Chowder.